Is Moon still deafened? Somebody ping Moon. everyone yes. into initiative which should be adding you all in a moment yeah and yummy's definitely laying down mm. only i'm laying down ready for his death <laughs> yeah. take me now i embrace this please rosary's dead somebody paying him we did. <clears throat> <laughs> Jesus Christ, Nizel. <laughs> there we go. They're here. All right, we're starting. Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, we're that's... starting. We're not starting. Uh, we're, we're starting. starting. Somebody leaves. You're, You're first in initiative, man. Uh, no, really I can't really actually really see the initiative for some- well, hold up, I need to, uh, I need to send him into initiative as well. That's an 11. Wait, oh, I'm first. We can see it, yeah. yeah okay, cool. Um, alright, I initiative. can't actually see initiative, which is- oh, nope, here they go. Yeah, it's- forward? it's starting to appear, it's starting to appear, it's just taking oh, a while. Oh, it's- hotkey is F, by the way. Wait, you can press F. F. Yeah, F yeah. will open an issue. The pay respect. Or the little sword above your uh, profile picture in the bottom left-hand corner. We've been over this before. <laughs> Did this session one? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Sorry, yeah. session yeah. two. Only... We're only level one. At the top. Yep. All right. Um, so it got an eleven, placing it. It's actually third from last. <laughs> All right. First to go is Moon. All right. Uh, this thing hasn't been moving that oh, fast. Uh, one last. Uh, one last uh, it's been kind of shambling after you. One last thing though, and I will give you this warning because this is your first boss fight. Remember your martial checks. Oh yeah, that's Start of your turn, you can do it to try and identify an ability. I thought you were taking that out. No, I no, think clashes. Uh, no, it's clashes that's taken out. It's not right, So, yeah, at the start of my turn, I guess I will do a martial check. So, uh, what do you got here? What do I roll again? Uh, oh, yes, it's hex for. So, if it makes strength checks, it will be a disadvantage. Yes. yes. Rosary, oh. don't forget you have bardic inspiration. Yep, got it. Oh, uh, Blalia probably had to vanish, I'm assuming. I'm gonna be right back in chat, yeah. so. Oh, okay. He'll well, probably mention it if, uh. Alright, let's fucking go. Is the Marshall check again? Uh, it is, is a wisdom check? thing. It, it is wisdom based, and if you have proficiency, you have proficiency. Oh, that's something you have to have proficiency in specifically? Yeah, anyone could take proficiency in it as part of a class background, etc. That was noted in character creation. Mm-hmm. No, alright. Well, <coughs> let's see, I think it's just a d20 plus one, yeah. Alright, there's a DC you're trying to meet. Sixteen. That is enough. All right, the names of the abilities, you get one. Uh, you can go ahead and choose one. Uh, there is Crystalline Infection, A Call to Hatred, Virulence, Spreading Parasite, Failure, Crystal Removal, Inject, Chatter, and Crystal Vitality. There's a lot of things there. There is a lot of things there. <laughs> It only has so much action oh. economy, though. Um, call for hatred. All right, a call for hatred. 
As an action, once per long rest, the Crystal Plague can break the crystals around it, summoning the two Crystal Soldiers to battle. Ah, hmm. oh, I see. Hmm, <laughs> yes. Virulence was in there as well. Virulence is one of the abilities, yes. There's a lot. We're going to, yeah, uh, of course, we'll let everyone know that that's a thing that looks like it can do. And then as our action, we will fire some shards of ice at it. Just, just going to spell right. attack. Spell attack, go ahead and roll your spell attack to hit. Uh, is that, oh, the 16 was the march attack, got it. Okay, that's so 24. Ooh! Yeah, that hits. Boise. Alright, uh, let me just double check this ability in my thing again, because I'm pretty sure, yeah. Alright, so it's gonna take this much cold damage. Uh. It takes. Three cold damage. Three cold damage, got it. <laughs> but its movement is cut in half. Ooh, okay. Oh, whoops, I hit the wrong button. One moment. I hit the, the kill button instead of the decrease by three button. <laughs> Alright. Uh, okay. With that, you know, I don't even want to be within line of sight of this thing. <laughs> I don't want to be here. So yeah, Lunas is gonna be like, "All right, slow it down." And uh, which one of these things let me measure how far I'm walking? Uh, it was oh. it was Alt. Or it was either Alt or Tab. Was one of the uh, was the? It might have been Tab. Hang on. Yeah. No, no, it wasn't Tab. No, no, it's not Tab. I know control, control is to move freely, which is you know not. Good. Was it spacebar? Try spacebar. Try spacebar. Ship. Spacebar or ship? One of the three. Yeah, it's ship. Gotcha. Yeah, you know, we're just gonna walk over here. Gotcha. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> we're just gonna say, alright, slow it down a bit. Alright. And this will be what I do. Hit the end turn button if you could. Uh, oh, wait, hang on. It's part with my sheet. Uh, it should be, like, the arrow up near where it says it's your turn. I've already clicked it, right? Like, I pressed space bar. Ah, uh, Orphe! <laughs> Orphe, you're up! Ready oh, okay, it's me! Ready okay. <laughs> I might. <laughs> um... Wheel! Uh, uh, I'm trying to remember how to fucking do shit here. Here, I'll name. I'll name I'll I'll type down the uh, ability names for you, Slot, because uh, you're trying to take yeah. it out. Can I, I get right here? Remember I don't your know. Your check, if you want to take it. Can I get right here? Uh, uh yes. Yeah. Four, five. That would only be twenty-five feet of movement. We're gonna get right here because then I can see it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't know how well this is gonna work. <laughs> Actually, I don't think it's within range. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. It's not. Fuck. How far? How close does it have to be? I need, to I need it to be within 30 feet. You have 5 feet left of movement. Yeah, but it's 50 feet for me, so... Oh. Oh, and you don't have cunning action yet. That's right. No, nope, I have it at That's next level. level two road. Um, and then. I will instead. Um. Nice on that handle. Actually, okay. So, <laughs> how does movement and then like something like misty step work? Does misty step take up your movement or no? Uh, Ooh, no, no, Misty no. Step is a teleport, it, it just, uh, moves Bye. you 30 feet. 
Okay, so if it's if it's a teleport movement, it doesn't count as your movement. No, it's not correct. because it's specifically a teleport. It's because the ability itself moves you 30 feet. It doesn't. It's not like a dash action, which just adds to your movement. It, oh, it so itself it's, it's, moves you. It's face step. It's face step that I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah, face step is face step is essentially misty step with extra effect. Okay, and I don't have to move the full 30. It's just nope. up to anywhere 30. within 30 feet. Yes. Okay. So okay. I'm just gonna stay right. You're gonna move. You're gonna use Missy step. Probably Missy step to where you are. Yeah, you can then use Missy step to where you are, and you then use your movement away if you want, to, like where you want to be. If you would rather do that. Okay. Yeah, if can I do that? do that? Yeah, I'll, I'll allow you to do that. Again, this is the first. This like the first serious combat encounter, so I'm not gonna be like yeah. monkey's paw. You've already done it. <laughs> um. Okay. So we'll Misty step to there. Got it. And then we will move up. I think it's 50 feet for me, right? <laughs> Eject. <laughs> uh, it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. It is, uh, yeah, it's 50 feet for me. Okay, so, and I'm, I'm going to move up 20 feet so I can get it within 30 feet. <laughs> All right, go for it. Move up 20 feet. <laughs> I'm, doing, I'm doing car wheels and shit, guys. Um, Our feet, heart wheels. Uh -huh. uh, move your token up twenty. Yes, give me. So that would be I, right here. I don't... Yes, it should be like right here. Yeah, yeah. There you go, and that'll put it thirty feet away from you. So within thirty feet, and then I need a charisma saving throw, please. Oh boy. Uh, let me check what I put its charisma as. It wasn't great. Don't believe. DC is 13. I'm opening a cheat real quick. Oh, actually, no. It was, it was kind of okay at least. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, a 10. That is a fail. It is baned. Ooh. That's a good oh, one. Boy. Oh, boy. The debuff. Now move away. The debuff. I'm gonna move 10 uh, feet. Oh, Remember your marshal check. Can I? Do, I can't do a marshal check, right? I had a phone call. I had. Oh, good. Okay. Anyone can do a marshal yeah. check. Just at the start of your I turn. It was... Well, I mean, I've already done my turn though. I'll again. I'll allow it. So I thought it was an act. Well, I, I was thinking it was. No, a no, no, no. A marshal check <laughs> is. All right. So to clear it up, a marshal check is in, is a free action. Oh, Anyone okay. can take it and. Uh, I'll probably just change it. Yeah, I'll just change it. It can be at any time during your turn, just so it's not like, ah, oh, you forgot it. Get fucked. Okay. I'll yeah. do I'll do that. Go for so it. what do I, I roll a wisdom? It is a wisdom check, yeah. If you didn't take okay. proficiency in it, it's like a it's a it's just a skill check, but it's if you didn't take proficiency in it, you don't have it. Actually uh, makes Flawlia one of the better uh what'd you roll? Twenty. Twenty, alright. You can learn an ability. You've um the list uh, is in general. And I have already told you a call to hatred. Okay. Um, let's do... Uh, shatter. Alright, Shatter. Uh, the, the Crystal Guardian lobs a crystal ball at an area within 60 feet of it. All creatures within a 5 foot radius of that area, of that point, must make a dexterity saving throw or suffer 1d6 slashing damage. Okay. Oh, my PC is apparently not plugged in. One moment. Let me fix that. <laughs> Calamitous disaster. By that, I mean shuts off. She may die here, guys. <laughs> ah, very clustered. I will say that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, learning that makes me not want to move now. Up to you. Uh, look, 1d6 won't trap you, but a melee swing from this thing might. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> I mean, it could drop some of us, though. <laughs> You're a El Neo <laughs> chuckles at 6 <laughs> HP. <laughs> Looks at the tank with 6 HP. HP. <laughs> Um. Uh, I'll just move up against the wall to like here. 
Got it. All yeah, right, you move. Right. That is your turn. Kristen Kai. All right. I'm um, assuming you I share am... the information about Shatter. Yeah, right? I was just about to say, or if you would have been like, uh, we probably shouldn't be grouped up. <laughs> I'm going to move, uh, here. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> As I am going to attempt a martial check, so I'm just... Got it. Identify that info. Like, this, sh this should work. Wow, okay. <laughs> okay what'd you roll? Oh, no, that, oh, that, that's not a roll. Oh, yeah, you just you just did whiz mod. Yeah. That's not a roll. Um... Uh... Do I have to type that out? <laughs> I don't know. I don't Rose honestly. I don't know how rolling with Astro works. Yeah. Thank you for uh, scribing, uh, Elnium. It helps. Oh, no problem. <laughs> I don't actually fucking remember how astral rolling works, but I'm I gonna attempt it. Yeah, that wasn't it. <laughs> uh, if you put the dice you want to roll. It puts it, it's it's an exclamation it's in, point, yeah. and then it's in parentheses, ah, and then you can add your then you plus add it, or yeah. minus inside of it. So it's exclamation, and then the parentheses? And start parentheses, 1d20, end parentheses, plus mod. Is there a space? Uh, no. I don't believe so. I uh, can't see if it rolled. Paul, I'll, okay. I'll tell you, Elmia, because you would have access. Call to Hatred, um... Call to Hatred, uh, releases the two crystal guys captured and makes them fight. Uh, you rolled a five. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Five. Um, then I am going to use... Eldritch Blast. Eldritch Blast. Got it. Send it. Uh... Uh, 23 to hit. And... Only the first is relevant. Goddamn. Uh, Wait, and you don't have though. agonizing yet, so it's just ten, right? Why is it adding that? Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Well. All right. Ten. That's yeah, it rolls 10. it as if I'm level eleven. That's weird. That's weird. Uh, it's still oh. ten points of force damage. Yeah. yeah. Oh, hold Christ. on. Actually, I need to check. The... Even the to hit bonus is wrong though. But it's a plus five, right? It says it's oh, yeah. the, the to hit bonus. Oh yeah, it changed. Yeah, it changed, changed, changed. Okay. Um, then I need to add one d six more. Oh yes, from hex. All right, go for it. Roll a d six. Uh. Oh, Goddamn. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Yes, <laughs> Eldritch Blast is having the same start as uh. Does the <laughs> the Virtus. Does the one that rolled a crit? Do you need the d ten from that? Because it says it's a delay uh, roll that has a there was through. there was not meant to be additional uh. There's not meant to be additional yeah. beams, there was only one beam because he's still level 1. Yeah. Mm, it's okay. just rolling yeah, versus I, uh, level 11 for some reason. I am using the one yeah, that was right. already on here instead of the one I had on my sheet. Yeah. Makes sense. Uh, I did find the place to uh, input your D&D uh, Beyond sheet though, I'll show you after this. Yeah, no, though I, I don't Do use... Uh, I know, but there. two, yeah, two okay. players I have to have use my sheet beyond. if I want to click it. There, yeah, 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 yeah. it works. Alright. Cool. With that out okay, of the way, is that um, your turn? It's a good turn. End turn is on the trucker. Uh, it it should be the button? arrow next oh, to where it arrow, says okay. here. Okay. Valia, you're up. All right, guys. Let's see who gets a bardic. <laughs> uh, and I will note because you weren't here. Uh, do remember mm -hmm. your martial checks, because mm -hmm. I was about to ask. Uh, yep. Um, and do remember the two abilities that have been identified so far are a call to hatred and shatter. Uh, shatter okay. basically throws a ball in a five and to a point, and everything within a five foot radius makes a dex save or mm -hmm. takes damage. And a call to hatred releases the two crystal fuck boys to come and fuck with you. Okay, and then may I quickly ask, did Moon attack or do something else? Um, Moon her threw turn? ice shard, which slowed him down. Okay. Yeah, she's slowed by thirty feet. No, yeah. not by dirty okay. feet. By half speed. Yeah. Yes. Okay, yeah, Moon's turn was the only one that I missed. Yes. Okay, um, so you know what, we'll make... We'll make a check first. Um, it. it's with... Wisdom. What is the modifier that wisdom. I use? It is wisdom, okay. Yeah, yeah. Helps if I'm looking at the right character. Ha 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 
Granted, I already know what it is, but I'm gonna pull it up anyway, because I'm pretty sure she has a minus one. Oh, yeah. Alright. Okay, let's see if I did this right. Nope. Um... Uh, no, it's exclamation point, uh, and then immediately parentheses 1d20 and parentheses oh. minus one. Okay. <laughs> Only him's death saves looking. That so wasn't that... horrible! That, that was, uh, it's a 14. I don't know why it didn't add the mod, but it's mm -hmm. a 14. That's still enough. So you this can, the is, list of abilities, horrible. the list of abilities is in general. The ones you haven't learned are Crystal Infection, Virulence, Spreading Parasite, Failure, Crystal Removal, Inject, and Crystal Vitality. You know, I'm curious about the last one, Crystal Vitality. Alright, Crystal Vitality. As an action. Uh, let me actually just open up my notes so I'm not doing it from memory. As an action, the Crystal Guardian regains a number of HP equal to 1d4 per infected creature. Uh, currently there are... Currently, there are two Before infected creatures. Okay. Okay. So she's just gonna call it. Oh goodness, well, uh, it gains HP if you get infected, so maybe try to keep your distance. It gains health, not HP. <laughs> Like that happen, I'm just gonna look towards you yeah, and like, don't worry about that. I'll have it handled. <laughs> don't worry about it, just okay, keep running. Then. And because you're the one that commented and said that you're gonna handle it, she's gonna cheer you on and Moon. give you her bardic inspiration. Moon already oh, has already a bardic. Bardic. Moon already has oh, a bardic. Oh, you do already? Yep, they, oh, it, they didn't okay. use it. Okay, then we'll give it to Tristan since he also attacked. Kristen Kai has obtained a bardic inspiration. All right, is that your turn? Um, let me zoom in. You move so in. I see where all our yeah, you move are better. in at all. Um, we're just gonna like go like here, so we're around the corner. Got it. All right. And that's the OT, and I'll hit the, the button. All right, his turn. All right, yeah, spooky boy. Orphy. Uh, at this, uh, as a bonus action, he's going to use Crystal and Infection. Orphe, I need you to make me a constitution saving throw as a line of okay. crystals tries to invade your goddamn body. So, uh, it was nice knowing you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you said a con yeah, save? Con save, line. please. I couldn't break line of sight. Five! Five, alright. You are infected with Crystal Plague. Please remember this. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I might okay. have to step away to call my grandmother in a moment. No, never mind. Um, well, no worries. Doesn't seem to be happening. Uh, okay, so, uh, and he will use his action to uh, activate a call to hatred. So, mm -hmm. this is once per long rest ability. I will roll initiative for these two. It will be added. Alright, crystal soldiers are added to initiative. They both rolled a 14. Funny. Uh, they will go on their next turn. Uh, in the same time, he is going to move up and 20. That is his movement. He gets there. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> You're so close. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's exactly 10, 10 14. <laughs> oh no. All right. Um, there. Uh, that is his turn. Rhea, you're up. All right, Marshall, check. For... All right, go for it. Tell me what you roll. I need to open the chaos tables real quick. In case. Oh come on. If she not wants on the skill check, something can go. Wrong. No, it's just, it's only when she casts a spell, but I still need to have them open. Why is it not rolling? Me. Astral is kind of dumb sometimes if you need to roll it in a... I'm rolling manually and it's nothing... It's just being laggy. If it no, rolls 102 it... times, I'm sorry. Oh, no. Like, did you click on the dice in oh. oh, there we go. Rhea, five. That is not enough to identify anything. That's fine. She's going to... Um... Well... 
you know what? It's now or never. We're gonna magic miss. We're gonna actually back up first. All right. Movement. All right, wait. Wait. Hold on. No, we're gonna magic missile this thing. All right. Roll me a d100, please. Yes. Please. Let's see if you get that wild magic. If she fireballs next to me, can I kill her in my next line? <laughs> if she fireballs there, I think she takes out the entire party and no one else. Oh no, she'll flip the boy. Wouldn't kill him though. Uh, alright. Why is nothing... D100, 23. 23! Jesus Christ, you keep rolling low enough. Alright, roll me another D100. Low grade wild magic surge. I just had the weirdest thing. <laughs> Weirdos started attacking me, then it exploded out of nowhere. Uh, 92. 92. Uh. <laughs> Alright. Roll me a d10, please. How many people are in this room? A two. Two. Alright. Every creature in combat takes two points of damage. And, uh, let me check the amount of creatures affected. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine is eighteen. Uh, you regain one first level spell slot. Oh, badass. Yeah. Sorry. But, uh, make Not sure to mark down badass. everyone. <laughs> badass! Everybody gets chipped for two, it two damage. I'm not in combat, Not I'm a pacifist! <laughs> God damn it, Elmium. You know... Someone in here is kind of a pacifist. Um, and then <laughs> here's her damage. <laughs> Hi, baby. Shit. Two All right. <laughs> Damage. <laughs> That's one hell of a magic missile. Yeah, it is. That's max damage magic missile. Oh no, that should be All fifteen. Right. That should be fifteen. Remember, magic missile adds a plus one to each bolt. Oh yeah. Jesus Holy Christ. shit. RKO out of nowhere. <laughs> Alright. And then she cartwheels away. Five. Yes. 10, yes. Twenty. Twenty. Alright. Thirty. Jesus now, Christ. Alright, hold on. I need to close out Astral. I need to reload the page. You guys have rolled two max damage rolls in so far. Jesus Christ. Oh, M1. I think I have fixed Hex and added a button to uh, add Hex to gotcha. Eldritch Blast. Got it. Nice. Thank heavens the D10 for the wild... Yeah, yeah. if it... If she had rolled max on that d10, she would have taken out the entire goddamn party. Yep. Had <laughs> the. Uh, I'm, I'm going to start with a uh, martial check. All right, go for it. Uh, that's fifteen. Fifteen. That is enough. Learn an ability. Uh, let's go with virulence. Virulence. As an action, all infected creatures, regardless of range, must make a constitution saving throw. On a fail, they uh, suffer 1d4 poison damage and are knocked prone. Okay. That seems okay. Um... Uh, how do you... Are potions a uh, bonus action or action? Bonus action on yourself. I guess I'll drink my potion, then... Got it. That's, uh, 2d4 and that's, plus... That is only for the most basic of potions. Anything higher than yeah. a, a normal potion is, you know... How much is that? Is that uh, 1d4? 2d4 plus 2. Okay. Is that 2d4? Okay, 7. 7 HP. Oh. Got it. That's, uh, plus 4 is 11. Okay. Yeah, you're at 11. Good. Um... Yeah. There. Um. And I guess I'll move into block the guy. Right. In there. And. On the uh, other side, attack. Right? 
with my right. halberd. Oh, hex concentration. Yeah, make uh, that was a thirteen. Got it. All right. Uh, yeah. Go ahead and make your attack with the halberd. That's a fourteen to hit. Fourteen, unfortunately, does not hit the crystal man. Okay, that's my turn. All right. Got it. Uh, after Elnia Moon, you're up. Moon, moon. All right. Moon, yeah. Moon. We have a spell slot left, so. Mm -hmm. The Marshall Shack. Got it. Roll it. Four. That right, is not I can't enough. find out, but I won't find out. Uh... And oh, uh, and now it fucking goes. Orphy. All right. Orphy. Yes. I need yes. you to make me a Constitution saving throw for Bane from getting dinked. Uh. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just remembered it. Just in case Moon casts a spell or something. Good to have. Good to have. Uh, what's your roll? Nineteen. Oh yeah. DC was ten. You took two points of damage. It's okay. not bad. Anyways, uh, you know. We'll try a spell. Might work, might not work. Uh, we know this thing understands Primordial. Yes. Yeah. Mm. So in Primordial, let's say, you will be my divine authority in Grovel. Okay. No, 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 no. And hold, as and I cast halt. command on it. Okay, you're casting yeah. command. I think it automatically passes if it's immune to charm. Uh, and it is a construct, it is a mute. Yeah, let's pull up the spell. I don't know oh, if the man does a... that or not. I thought it was an elemental. Well, guess what? Oh, well. It's both. Ooh, bullshit, wait a moment. <laughs> it's, it's an Hang elemental on, inside a construct. Wait, would I be charging the elemental or the construct? It's all one creature. It's double typed. Alright. <laughs> oh, is that a thing here? <laughs> yeah. Multi typing is absolutely a thing. Um. Uh, uh yeah, spell has no effect if the target is undead, if it doesn't understand your language, or if the fan is directly harmful to it. Oh, well, wait. Is it, is it not immune if it's not nope, charmed? Nope. Not immune huh. if it's <laughs> immune in the charm. Aha! You nearly nerfed yourself. I'm glad we checked. Alright. Man, is such a good spell. Alright. Get the minus d4. So, wisdom save. Uh, with the minus d4, yeah, that's correct. Alright, wisdom save. That is a plus. Oh, it's a plus. I feel bad now. Yeah, but it has a minus d4. Yeah. Have faith. Have faith. Put your faith in the light. Wisdom save. I'll roll the d4. Now. Okay. Four. It didn't even need the d4. All right. It will halt. All right. Its next turn will be spent halting. <laughs> All right. It's gonna just stand there for a bit, guys. Uh, Moon walks back over here. Moon's like, fuck this. Like, Moon just came out of from around the corner, shouted some random words at it that no one understood, and then, like, left. He <laughs> just stops. Stands at fucking attention. Alright. Uh, wait, I need to press the funny button. Press the funny button. Orphy, right. you are currently plagued. Let me check one thing about Uh, man. yes. At the start of your turn, make me a con save. Alright. Alright. You hit plague tier 2. Uh, it's all prone. How much damage do I take? Nope. That is virulence. That is a that is an active ability. You have no clue what plague uh, does at this moment in time. I thought... The crystal no. infection... No. I no. You guys one. identified virulence. Mm -hmm. You have not identified crystal infection yet. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I will do a martial check, I guess. Got it. 
aff, rep, four, five. Right. Got it. Um, I and then... Him. Yes, what is your question? Does seeking no actions include reactions? Uh, it says no action on their turn. So, no. They oh, can still take... Yeah. Right, That's all, right. all command says. Right. It just says on their turn they take no action. With Hall. Mm -hmm. The target moves and takes no action. The flying creature stays alive. Uh, no, it does say no action. Uh, hold up. No, it's follow that command on its next turn up in the head header text of the spell. So, no. Uh, Halt would not stop it from, like, reaction slapping Elmium if he ran away. Mm hmm. I'm just going to toll the dead. I need a wisdom save, please. Alrighty. Uh, minus D4. D4. DC 13. Because I don't want to open this again. 1d20 plus 2 minus 1d4. 14. See the Passes. Um, and then... Uh, what are you doing, RP? Uh, trying to see where I can get to. I'm just gonna get down here in between Moon and Flalia. Right. Moon, Flalia, con saves, please. Hmm. Mm. Wait, hang on. You're grouping up. I'm confused now. I can do it. I'm, saying, I'm running please. away from what I'm doing. <laughs> no, Moon said that Why am I making a con save? Because you are next to, to an infected, infected person. Yep, yep. Here, oh, it God. infectious. They 21. Virus. 21. Flalia passes. I'm going to yeah, pass. Yeah, I'm going to pass. Flalia's like, nope. Yeah, should have worn a mask. <laughs> Thought you wore a mask. No, I'm gonna assume like a crystal or something left at her. Uh, she basically we got all, like, a, a line, line of crystals, crystals hitting her. Uh, natural one. Oh yeah. boy. Natural one. <laughs> all right. Moon, you take tier one yeah, infection. Yeah, Lolly is gonna like gonna like roll to the side a little bit. And she's like, <laughs> ah, careful, that's the right. just between you. Lolly, you may move up I'm five feet in any down. direction just to get the fuck out. As part of this, is how the ability what? works. Basically, if you succeed on the save, you move five feet away from the infected person. So, like, you could go so. here, or here, or here. Actually, should I try? What's the bardic dice again? It's a d6. It's, a d6. it's, it's not gonna save you. I can dream. You can dream. Poor moon. Alright. I can't move anywhere because I'm already against the stupid wall. Yep. Wait, so did they just do nothing? Uh, what do you mean? No, never mind, just go. Or if he cast a spell, the spell right. failed, and then they ran past you and you got infected. Okay. As the uh, crystal parasite essentially jumped from you towards Flalia, or from Orphe towards you and Flalia. Mm -hmm. And now we're right. doing Tristan, you're up. All right. Uh, <laughs> once again, do an Eldritch Blast, and now we can see if uh, if that worked. All right. You want to attempt a Marshall check? Uh, you do have a Bardic, just going to say. Uh, I will use the Bardic. <laughs> we'll use the Bardic. Um, 1d6. No, that's a 7. All right, that hits. Two points of force damage. And uh, six necrotic. And six necrotic. God damn. Oh, yeah, the shit, the hex thing worked. Nice. He's a learning yeah. how to code <laughs> his sheet. Nice. Uh, then... So, eight points of damage. He's halted still. 1d20 plus what? 19 on a Marshall. 19. What do you want to learn? Um... Let me get the exact name. 
Uh, Crystal Infection. Alright, Crystal Infection. As a bonus action, the Guardian forces a creature to make a constitution saving throw. The DC is 13. On a fail, the target is infected with Crystal Plague. At the start of each of the creature's turns, they must make another constitution saving throw. Uh, for each failure, the Crystal Plague tier increases. At Crystal Plague tier, uh, tier 2, which is one above infection, what Arfia has at the moment, they spread the infection in a radius of 5 feet around themselves. At Crystal Plague Tier 5, they must make a Wisdom save at the start of their turn, or lose their turn, and I take their turn. Okay. Alright. Boy. Um, I'm just gonna, I mean, basically just tell people to stay away from each other. And I don't know how to do radiuses with Astral, so that they don't just look like a blob of light, but just remember, anyone within five feet of Orphe is in danger of the plague zone. Can I get double infected by Orphe? You don't know. You want to fuck around? Uh, mm, Alright, Tristan, go out. ahead and end your turn. Alright. Alright. Uh, Chris Soldier 1, he's gonna move 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, and he'll dash. So he's 5, 10, 15. So he is here, so he's cutting off Elnium's retreat. That is his turn. Next Crystal Soldier. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, dashing, 5, 10, 15, 20. I'll run up to Elnium. Alright. Uh, Flalia, you're up. Long sight G. Valia. I am muted, and I was also reading over the stuff. Um, good God. So those things are there. They're the yellow things. First of all, she's going to give a generalized, don't get too close to Orphe. You did it um, again. Huh? Go back to your Flalia voice. Oh god, I don't know why I was having trouble. Mm -hmm. Why do I keep doing that? Okay. Don't get too close to Orphe. I'm not, I'm not sure, but they, they tried to leave off of her onto me. Yeah, it's a bit late for that. It's a bit late for that. I learned as you did. Yeah. Well, doesn't matter now. Besides, it doesn't matter if we kill this thing. <laughs> Sorry, we're just gonna like. Okay, so wait, I'm here, so that. I think I've got 30. Yeah. <laughs> Two. Right. Eh. Work with me, map. Eh. No, it's not gonna let me. Okay, that's fine. Everything's fine. One. Two. Or I guess it'd be one. Two, because we're not gonna take over your space. Three. Four. Alright. Five. We're gonna go 25 for now and hug the wall. Did you want to make a martial check? Oh, freak, yeah. Probably should have done that first, actually. Mm -hmm. I'm, I keep forgetting about the thing. Yeah, it's all good. Again, I'm gonna remind you guys a lot because this is your first, like, boss encounter, so it's all good. I'm not trying to play Monkey's Par. Gotcha. On this one. Four. Nothing. Four. Never all mind. Right. Oh, question. Just moving away. What level do you get Jack of All mm -hmm. Trades? <clears throat> I want to say it's three. Level two. Like a level. It is two. Oh crap! I was just checking because that will apply to martial checks since it's just another. Ha 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 But yeah, no, we're gonna. We will action dodge, dodge. I suppose. Got it. Okay. <sighs> yes. Okay. Go ahead and hit your end turn uh... button if you could. <laughs> yeah, I was just debating a moment longer if I want to use the last five, but we're just gonna go 25. Got it, go for it. Uh, Crystal Plague will be halted on his turn, he will not do anything. Rhea, you're up. Alright, Rhea will shoot her magic missile 
Wait. You will need to get line of sight if you wish to, unless you want to shoot at the soldiers. No, I lied. We're gonna move five. trying to think here. Uh, no, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna shoot this crystal soldier, but we're gonna use mine sliver. Got it. So I need what? a... They need an Why? ink say, right? Yeah. yeah, DC 12. Got it. And is the one uh, just south, like, the one around the corner already, right? Yeah. Got it. Uh, never mind. Uh, int save of plus zero. I don't know if it's sent to chat yet. It has not. I just see Flawley as four. God damn it. Oh, I'll just roll E. Come on, Astro. I double click. Clicking one. Alright, whatever. Just gonna roll in the in Discord. Uh, four. Failed. You hit. Well, or rather, it gets fucked. You know. They take whatever. one point, one point of psychic damage. Got it. Uh, and uh, does Mind Sliver have any I other effect? I I don't. Um, it's a minus 1d4 to the next saving throw. Yeah, but then, already... like, around. So. Got it. I don't think the d4 is... Yeah. Oh, it's not Bane, though, so that's pretty Not cool. Bane. No, yeah, you can absolutely yeah, stack d4s. Fun. Um, and then... She's just... I can't make a martial check because I can't see it, right? Uh, yes, that is correct. You would have to move okay. up to see it. She's... She's just gonna stand right here, and Got it. that's the end of her turn. All end right. of your turn. Elnium, the boy, you are currently surrounded. Uh, yeah, I am. Boy. Uh, I'm going to start with a martial check. Go for it. Go. See what you can learn. That's a 13. 13 is just what you need. Alright, what do you want to okay. learn? Okay, what do we have left? Um... You have not learned... Spreading Parasite, Failure, Crystal Removal, Inject. I think that's uh, it. Let's go with uh, Spreading Parasites. Spreading Parasite! Uh, as a bonus action, the Crystal Guardian can cause two infected creatures to spread their infection to another creature within 10 feet of that creature. So, basically, he could say, as a bonus action, as Crystal Soldier, Crystal Soldier, jump the Parasite to Elvia, and then you are infected. Okay. It basically uh, takes multiple creatures to set up, but then can infect people more easily. Yeah, and there's no save there involved. Is. Yeah, there is no save. Which is the... It's the main benefit to him setting up. Him. Um... Uh, yeah, I'm going to attack the Gorgon. Got it. Roll the hit. Okay. Trying that again. Okay. Uh, 20 will hit. <laughs> 11 damage. Okay. Fucking hell. Yeah. Great Bottom weapon over... fighting. That's useful on this one. Goddamn hell, um, you're in darkest dungeons. Okay, so nothing on my bonus section. Uh, can you remind me what the Guardian did on its last turn? What the Guardian did? Uh, the Guardian yeah. was halted by, uh, Moon's spell, so oh, it did right, nothing right, on right. its last turn. Um, yeah, I'm not going to move. That's it for me. Got it. All right, Moon, you're up. All right. Your halt is worn off. Over here. Yep. Oh, uh, you are. Oh, oh sorry. One, go. one moment. One moment. Start of your turn. You are infected. Go ahead and make me a comp save. Mm -hmm. See if the infection deepens. No, I don't. Trust, I don't trust. Uh the other thing now. I'm just gonna use the body here. Uh, what'd you roll? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wow. Oh, wait, 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 that's charisma. 
Oh yeah. Uh, it's, it's so you just rolled two nat one. one. It's a nat one. It's a nat one. I don't know. Your that's con save is what a five one. or four. So that's a five. It's not. Uh, it's not high enough. You are now radiating a five foot aura of plague. No right. Well, doesn't matter. All right. All right. Doesn't it's matter. Try it. Matters if kill it. <laughs> Got it. it. Matters if it's <laughs> You gonna make a martial check? You just gonna go for it? We'll make the martial check. Got it. Cause you know we probably should prepare to know what failure is. Sixteen. All right. Failure. You want to learn what failure is? Yeah. All right. As a bonus action, the crystal plague forces all infected creatures to have disadvantage on their next roll. Yo, that's just being mean. <laughs> it's just being mean. Hang on, hang on. Does that does that mean it considers us a failure? No, it's making you fail. Making you a failure, you Rosary. You don't do that here. Uh, Positive reinforcement only, bro. I mean, with Moon, it doesn't really need to do that because of the nat one. Oh my god. We're in here, little shit. We're letting it infect Indeed. us so we can use own energy against it and roll a crit. Dirty 20. Close enough. Uh, what was that? We're just gonna find some ice shard. We're just doing ice shard. Oh, again. okay. Got it. Yep, from your uh, your ice herald passive your, your, your ability yeah. or whatever. Mm -hmm. This isn't spell, so I can't do that. So, uh, wow. Ooh, point some damage. You know what? At least I did damage to it. <laughs> Doesn't is oh, it's ice knife? I'm thinking of. Is that what you're yeah. using? Nope, no, that's uh, it's they have an ability as an ice sorcerer and... that they can throw ice shards, but its movement speed is slowed. And Moon's going to just look towards everyone that's moving away. <laughs> Guys, we kind of need you to actually hurt the thing. Oh, I can't do that, sorry. <laughs> I can't do that! Oh my god. And the moon's just gonna look back towards the creature annoyed. Got it. Alright, moon. If I move here, I'm not within five feet of anyone, correct? Correct. Oh, first, start your turn. Con save, see if you get more infected. 18. 18, you are not- your your infection does not deepen, so you are still at rank 2. I move here. And, uh, I'm gonna try to shoot Crystal right. Boy. Roll for it, if you can. Wait, which Crystal Boy? The- this one, right here. What? Okay. Alright, go for I it. Can't... See the other one. Yeah, she can't see the other one without getting in range of you again. Or unless she wants to give it half cover. Like, you could step up one spot and it would have half cover against your shot. Uh. Short bow, not a crossbow. 15? 15 hits. Alright, and then it's a d6 for sneak? Uh, yes. It's within 5 feet of an ally? Uh, wow. Five, six points. Six points of damage. damage. Alright. It gets dinked. Oh, no. Damage is damage. Damage yeah. is damage. And, uh, that's yeah. my turn. Alright. Kristen Kai. Make sure you hit the end turn button. Actually, Orphe, did you want to yeah. marshal check it? I don't think I can see it. Oh, yeah. No, you would have to step up. Never mind. Yep. Got it. Um, oh, I think my food's here. I'll be right back. Let's see. Marshall, check actually that R is not needed. <laughs> there. Hey. Um. Unfortunate. You do yes. Not. Uh. I want to uh, do something other than you know Eldritch Blast. <laughs> <laughs> so I will. Um. I'm going to use Mental Lock on Crystal Plague. Alright, what are you trying to lock off? Um... 
I'm going to try and lock failure. All right, got it. Make so that's a wisdom save. A wisdom save. That's all right. Minus the d4. If it's uh, the crystal thing. Yep, it is. He's trying to lock off one of its abilities. His Psyox. Uh, plus two, minus one d4. Let's see. Okay, never mind. It says no. Jesus. <laughs> I tried! Well, <laughs> <laughs> but what if we did it? <laughs> you know, that could have been your nat 20, Diesel. <laughs> well, shit. Oh, it didn't work. Last measle. <laughs> Only if we do we, do we want to see? Please? Do we want to see what would have ha would have been? You can roll it if you, you want. Ha! <laughs> nah, it would have missed. It would have missed. Nah. It wouldn't have mattered. All right. Um, I am a failure. All right. Yeah. You are a failure. Uh, Crystal Soldier 1, which is the incredibly hurt one, will go ahead and try and stab Elnium. Let me check what I had on these guys' attack mod. Actually, wait a moment. They're, it's on their goddamn token. Oh, did these ones have to be over? Like on their token. Yeah, it fucking reads a scimitar still, because I didn't oh. edit these ones. Alright. Eh, well, whatever. It's a 7 to hit. Nope. Elnium. Nah. Said, yeah. All right, Crystal Soldier Two will go ahead and he'll do the same thing. Yeah, twenty-four. That, All right, that is it's meant to be one d four. So let me just hey, yeah, it's meant to be one d four plus two. So one moment. I didn't edit these tokens. Shoot. Three, three points of damage on him. It's staying. Okay. All right, Lalia. Hi there. What do you want to do? Yeah, um, speaking as a free. So we moved over there. We'll get a little bit closer again, and we'll go here. Uh, um, speaking as a free action moon, up to a certain point. Like you can only like if you're gonna go ahead and try and give an entire battle speech in the middle of battle, it's gonna take you a couple turns, but. If you're just trying to mm -hmm. shout out, like, hit this thing, or, you know, something, like, very short, I'll allow it. Got it. Uh, sorry, what are you doing, Flavia? Not much I really can do, um... Can't hurt a fly. Not no, hurt. not really, no. Literally. Let's see, let me check this really quick. No, we're not getting that close, hell no. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're going to just kind of like start playing on the pan flute, trying to like, in, like pay, play like encouraging music, I suppose. And, All right. Uh, just, just gonna take dodge action again. Got it. Do you need me to roll performance? <laughs> Even though it doesn't uh, do anything. Sure, we'll say roll performance, see if you can get anything out of it. I was just thinking for a generalized, like, generalized, like, does it sound any good? Do, yeah, do I mean, that too, like but, it? that too, but, you know. It's only a 12. 12. Alright, you start playing a tune. The jaunty tune. A tune to die mm -hmm. to. <laughs> Alright. I moved, like... I moved like 15 feet and now that's you too. Got it. No, I think it's funny. This character might actually use counter charm. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh my god. I just, uh, I just like to imagine that, uh, Flalia starts playing some hardcore fucking metal music, like what we're listening to right now. Hold <laughs> 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 right. electric guitar. <laughs> As a bonus action, Tristan Kai, a She's playing a pan suit, man. As a bonus action, Tristan Kai, a line of uh, crystalline spores will head towards you. I need you to make me a constitution saving throw as it attempts to infect you. Alright. Uh, there. Five. That is just enough. You are not infected. There are one, two, three, four people infected. 
it will go ahead and use its action to use Crystal Vitality. I hate to say, isn't it? Well, yeah, no, because they didn't get they didn't get him. Never mind. One, two. Oh, I should have moved back a bit. Oh, I will. <laughs> All right, it heals thirteen HP. No, it's a D4 for each person. I it's thought it's killed. It. Nope, it's a D4 per uh, person infected. No. That, alright. That is its turn. That is unfortunately its action. Yeah, and also, I'm just gonna go ahead and speak now. Alright, go for say, it. Don't forget, we're not trying to kill these people. Just focus the big thing and we can be out of here already. Alright, Moon is shouting that. Alright, Rhea, you're up. Uh, well, hearing that, Rhea just stands here. Because she's not gonna get closer, seeing as that thing just shot a line of crystals at Tristan. She knows that Orphe's infected. She can see that Moon is infected. Alright, do nothing then. Yeah. Alright. If... So, what do you want to do? You just gonna hold your action or something? Um, I actually need to take a step back. Um, I'm gonna hold an action to Mind Sliver if the big guy gets in my range, but I'm gonna take a step back. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, go ahead and... I'll just hit it to Elnium. Elnium, you're up! What do? Elnium is still upside down. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, okay, so we still have a couple abilities we haven't marshal checked. Yes, but there's um, a few you have not learned. I don't think you've learned inject crystal removal or actually I think that's, that's... it. And I think yeah, that's, that's it. it. Yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay, yeah. I oops. Try to do that. At the seventeen. Uh yep, that's enough. Uh, trying to guess... Crystal removal. Alright, all creatures infected with the Crystal Plague make a con save DC 13. On a fail, they suffer 2d4 piercing damage as crystals erupt out of them. Uh, whether they pass or fail this con save, they are then cured of the Crystal Plague. This can only be used when three or more creatures are infected. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, Basically the nuke button. Okay. Um, How much damage did that do? <laughs> uh, 2d4. Piercing damage to everyone that is infected. And then they are cured. If they if they fail a DC 13 concept. Yeah. That's uh, not a good situation to be in. Oh, I'm not sure what to do. Um, I don't really want to take 2d6 from the soldiers. Um, man. Uh, I'm going to attack um, the most, yeah, the most wounded one. Uh, sorry, say that again? Uh, I'm going to attack the 2 HP soldier. Got it. Go for it. Swing on him. 21, that hits. He is down. I'm assuming non-lethal? Yeah. Alright, deck save, please. Mm-hmm. I'm just going to roll it. Yeah. 14. Got 14. it. Yeah, you don't take any damage. Great. Um, yeah, I'm good here. I'm not going to move. Got it. All right, after Elnium, it is Moon. Moon, you're up. All right, we're going to go ahead and cast. You know what, we're just going to do the ice shard thing again. Got it. So, uh, yeah, plus five. That hits. 16 would have hit anyway, but yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Roll damage. And then after that, we'll do the martial check. So More that's damage. four full damage. Okay. And then the martial check. Got it. What don't we know yet? Uh, the only ability you don't know yet is inject. What does inject? All right. Uh, it is his basic melee attack. 
If the target is hit, it makes a DC 13 con save or be infected with Crystal Plague. It deals 1d4 plus 3 damage. Okay. Uh, also need to make one of these, which is probably going to be a Metter Nat 1. Uh, plus 5. That so is... So that's level 3 on the infection. Next. Yep, level 3. Not Got it. Up. I'll move right there and that. Got it. After that, uh, hit the end turn button. Orphe, you're up. Uh, I can't see this dude, right? Uh, unless you move up like 10 feet, and there's nobody. Um, you could get into line of sight with it without a. Yeah, you could go there. You could go there. And you wouldn't be like within five feet. You could even go there if you want. You wouldn't be within five feet of anyone. Could I get here? That'd be fine. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, five, thirty. Yeah, you could get here or here. I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna get right here. Got it. And then, um, actually, <laughs> I probably should have checked the. No, yeah, it's within range. Um, I am going to attempt to chill touch. Chill touch it? Got it. Yeah. Fine. I got the one thing I did, thank God. <laughs> Somebody has I said, spell. I was so confident I had chill touch. Looked at my sheet. Why is it not there? <laughs> Moon's like, wait a moment. Oh no, I don't have it. Alright, roll your to hit. Yeah, I guess. Uh, 15. That hits. So, 4 necrotic damage. And it cannot heal. That's the big one. Yes. Got it. And, um... I think... I think that's all I can do. Alright. The end turn button then. Tristan Kai. Um, uh, one thing. Con save. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry. right. I forgot it as well. Con save. You're, you. you're only at rank 2. You're, you saves. You're still at rank 2. I shall blast with Eldritch Power. Eldritch Blast. Say the line, war. Boy. Ten. I do a miss again. Jesus Christ. Alright, well. I need bonus actions. <laughs> do you have any bonus actions? No, I need them. <laughs> I believe right. in your bonus act in economy. I believe in your bonus act. Got it. Um, yeah. I was gonna move, but not anymore. <laughs> Crystal Soldier moves here, so he is within five feet of two people. Haha. -ha. Checkmate. Well, then... Oh no. What? This one's edited? What? Okay, whatever. I don't fucking care. Alright, Moon. Twelve. Misses. All right, Flalia, you're up. Woo! Time to be useless again. Oh, no. Um, um. We'll move up a little bit since, you know, there's some room now. <laughs> <laughs> now that nobody's infected. Nearby, at least. Um. Yeah, we'll go here and I guess we're just gonna take the dodge action and keep playing that pan flute, man. Alright. Oh. She is getting nervous. That was not Jesus very Christ, good. Jesus Christ, that was a bad fucking pan flute play. Kinda squeaks out and you're like, Freaking... Sure. I imagine, honestly, she's trying to, like, dance around as the dodge action and she, like, accidentally, like, drops the flute and has to pick it back up. Yeah. <laughs> Not having a good time. All right. No. Uh. All right. We're gonna use the crystal plague. It's going to go ahead as a bonus action. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. It's got insured. All right. Bonus action. Spreading parasite. Elnium, you are now affected. Uh, Using moon and the crystal soldier as the bounce points. Uh, with that, 
Uh, its action will then be... Alright, Virulence. I need... Uh, Moon, the Crystal Soldier, Elnium, and Orphe to make constitution saving throws. Boy. Right. I'm gonna die! Elnium says no. I'm just, I'm just gonna try one thing again, and after that, it is probably just going to be Elder Blast City. Jesus Christ. Oh, down, I am eating. Down. He just says no. Yeah, Elnium just says no. I'm tired of this shit. No, you didn't. Wait, hang on, I have a question, Jim. What's your question? If you have received the pill, that you're free of the infection. No, if you succeed a save, you're not free of infection. It's when the thing dies, you're free of infection. That was another one. This is very illness, oh, yeah. right? Crystal, just... crystal removal is the, uh... Crystal removal is the one that kills... Or doesn't kill. They fire. It breaks crystals out of everything, and then ends the plague. This yeah. is the one where you take one d four poison, right? Uh oh. Well, mm -hmm. first I need one d four poison and prone. Yep, one d four poison, and it knocks you prone. Uh, this was his crystal. Okay, so he takes one d four poison. So he takes two poison, and he's knocked prone. The soldier. Good. Elnium says no. Um, Moon, what did you roll? I rolled a nineteen because I went right. at the average. Moon Nine. passes. Orphe. I forget. I rolled you roll, okay, you take two points of damage and are knocked prone. Uh, Not as poison. much effect as, as he uh, wanted it. A 16 for Bane. 16 for Bane, yep. Then you hold it. Again, DC was 10. You're okay, you're okay. Alright, that was his turn. Rhea, you're up! There is clear area to move. 25. She can see the guy. She's gonna shoot her last magic missile at him. Got it. Roll me a d100. Uh, that's... Is that including? That is including mm -hmm. it. Yeah, Alright, cool. 82. 82 is not enough to provoke a wild magic surge. So, 8. And then 5 points. Duck back down. End of turn. Got it. Points of damage. Damage. In Elnium. Yes. You're up. Okay, um... 15 HP seems... Doable, uh, if I get a crit. I and attack the Gordon. Got it. We are good on martial checks, right? Yeah. Yeah, you've identified everything. Okay, let's go. One attack on the Gordon. Alright, try it. Oop. Nope. Nope. Boy. Um... Don't... Yeah, that's that's going to be it, yeah. Not Please moving. don't let this be like when you guys failed to hit a sleeping creature for three rounds. Please can god, I move, no. Can, <laughs> can, I move <laughs> over, can I move this way, Liam? Yeah, you can Hey, that around. crystal soldier was OP, man. He was fucking rock right, lean. Lean over here, and she's going to hold a hand out. Alright. As I need to go double check the spell real quick. What spell? Frost fingers. Oh boy, alright. It's like a cone, and then it's a con save, I think. Is this a con save? I thought it was... A... It is a con save. Yeah, it's... It's, uh... So, old burning hands. So with less damage. So, have make me a con save. Alright. Minus D4! <laughs> Minus D4! We take uh... the wins. We take what we can. Y'all haven't targeted the saves it's actually good at. I'm saying. Haven't done it, made it make a deck save or a strength save yet. Hey. Uh, here. I'll just roll it here. Uh, uh, no, nope, 21. D4 would not help. Mercury. Okay, yeah, three points of damage. damage. Let, us, let us dream, Doom! <laughs> <laughs> mm. Dream when you're dead. Right. Uh, you know, that is a real possibility for yeah. people here. <laughs> Christ. No, for what people? Oh, hi. Mm, uh, Rosary, we're not doing this again. Alright, Orphe. No one. Oh, my no one sorry. Here. I your turn. I'm sorry. 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 I'
I'm just mocking you. Oh, no, it's too late. Oh, um... I would like to... Rage. Yes. <laughs> Surprise, like guys, rage. I'm actually a barbarian. Um, Ranged barb the wanna, entire uh, time. <laughs> I want to try to uh, chill touch it again. Alright, got it. Oh, wait, I need to make Conte first, right? Uh, yes. To see if you go up to rank 3. 20. Uh, Moon, Moon needs to make it as uh, well. Yep, just make it real quick. Uh, 17. Alright, you stay at rank 3. Uh, Moon, you're at rank 3. Oh, you're you're at rank misses. 2 still, or 9 misses, unfortunately. Um... And then... I'm just going to, uh... Get back one more. That's my turn. Alright! <laughs> Tristan Kai! Okay, um... What a guy. I have two things I can do, and one is a gamble upon a gamble, and the other one is also a gamble. <laughs> All right. So, I'm gonna take the more indirect one. Uh, I'm just gonna try again with a mental lock, but this time for uh, crystal vitality. Okay, got it. Uh, it is a wisdom save, right? Minus D4. Yes. Minus. <laughs> he beat you to it. I know. Three plus two. I still want minus to One D4. Hey, it's well. How that's a fail. Haha! Yes! <laughs> Before help! For the next 24 hours, it can't use that piece of shit ability! <laughs> <laughs> Alright! Oh, nice! <laughs> that's okay. the one that's, that's the one that did 2d6 or whatever, right? No, that's the one that it, heals. No, it, it, heals, heals it. it. It can't heal itself oh, yeah. anymore. Okay, okay, we have a chance. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm also going to yell that out. It won't heal anymore! Alright, beat the shit out of it till it dies. <laughs> Alright. This crystal soldier will attempt to stab our good friend Moon. Fuck? No problem. Hit honestly. I'll be yeah. surprised if it doesn't. Just makes Five. me think of Brave. Nat one. Nat one, Moon. <laughs> I'll be surprised if it <laughs> doesn't hit. Her. I've seen stuff fumble. Moon. <laughs> Moon looking at this crystal soldier. <laughs> you. What? You surprised me. <laughs> You're up. Yeah, no, when he said that, and they were just like, all right, everyone get it. Made me think of in the movie, in the Disney movie Brave, when they saw a bear and her dad, Argus, just kind of looked at it and went, get it! And they all <laughs> charged it and started getting it. Get it! All right. Um, you know, we're just going to stay where we are and continue what we're doing. Woo, let's play that pan flute, because it's, I'm right. totally useful, guys. Okay? Pull me the performance check. 18, alright. I will say that at this point you have played long enough. Who do you want to inspire? Give him a bardic. <gasps> We're gonna inspire... I'm gonna give it to Elnium. Alright, Elnium, you feel inspired by the pan flute. Yeah. The pan, the pan flute of haunting. <laughs> oh no, everybody <laughs> runs away. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I felt inspired by the healing being gone. Already. Yeah. It's a combination. It's the combination. Uh, and then, yeah, dodge action and that's the two. Alright. Crystal Plague. Uh, first off, bonus action. Tristan Kai, make me that save, please. Alright. Your piece of fear. Left, guys. Don't oh! save. Alright, you're infected. Alright. It slams its hands into the ground. Elnium, the Crystal Soldier, Moon, Tristan, Kai, and Orphea, uh, or Orphe. Uh, roll me a Constitution save against yeah. Crystal Removal. Uh, that's what I was worried oh, about. This is the, oh, um, this is the big one. Elnium you know says Dude, no. Can I, can I just good. completely say no to this? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it's safe for none, so. Uh, so I rolled a 19. I think everyone passed this save. Yeah, I think everyone passed this <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no. 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19, 19. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Boss is like, yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm hitting the nuclear button, everybody. But what if? <laughs> but what if you didn't? Even his own <laughs> minion passed. Oh, wait a fucking second! His minion's now no longer infected! It's a guard! Oh my yeah! god. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, well, 
You found another man. Shakes his head. What, what the fuck? Uh, and Get everyone, up, everyone, <laughs> everyone, your infection is Just reduced to zero. Say what, Doom? I'm sorry. Uh, everyone, your infection is reduced to zero. Rhea, you're up. Woo. On your Sir! <laughs> Gonna move up five, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, 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 thirty. Things thirty feet. Nope. Yep. Okay. In. I need a uh, an int save from it, please. An int save. Got it. All right. It will go ahead and I think there's a plus two minus a d four. Let me let me just double check. Hey, the D4 is doing work. Yeah, it has. It has made two saves <laughs> fail so far. It is fucking saves that wouldn't have failed otherwise, and you turned off. It helped turn off the goddamn healing. Yeah, yeah like <laughs> I was going to just Eldritch Blast it, but then Chill Touch missed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It did it roll? It rolled. A uh, it's rolling in the moment. Thirteen. Oh, it mm. passes. Unfortunate. Three. Nothing happens. That's the end of her turn. All right. Unfortunate. Oh, wait, no, that's not the end of her turn, sorry. Oh, what are you doing? Now that's the end of her turn. Alright. <laughs> Time to leave, cartwheels away. Yeah, I'm yeah. sure it can't affect us. You've got a cartwheeling gnome, and you've got a cartwheeling elf. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright. A, a uh, rippling it's gnome. Blue button, uh, after Rhea, hit the end turn button if you could. Elnium, you're up. Okay, I'm attacking the... Chris of Blade. Oh, it's Hit it for once. Woo! 17! Uh, uh, for 6 uh, slashing damage. Yeah. Got it. Chunk. More crystal falls off. Uh, yeah, that's it. Got it. It is looking very bad. Moon! Alright. That thing's not made of metal, or else I would walk up and try to punch it with shocking grass. No, it's made of crystal. <laughs> However, uh, this guy is normal now, right? Oh yeah, he's a oh, he's yeah. a he's an ally at this moment, so he's not in yeah, imminent range of attacks. Towards him. Hey, look, giant crystal thing over there. Yeah. I'm just gonna uh, point yeah. him towards it. Fire a few shards of ice at it. Oh. Kill it, Moon. Kill it. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and 19. That'll and hit. Roll above average for one time. Hey. hey! Once. You get one above average. Alright. And with that, how do you want to slaughter? Like, as Moon just points to his cigar, she just, like, like points at it. Alright, so we need you to help us kill that thing. And she just snaps her fingers, and then, like, shards of ice just fly out and hit it. <laughs> Alright, and the crystal around it starts to crumple, and it will suffer its remaining HP. Hey, yeah, oh. can you help us take this thing down? Snaps, it falls. Oh. Oh, never mind. Oh. Um, as it is on <laughs> the ground, it. the green kind of crystalline form of whatever it was that was, uh, like, the, the mobile body of this thing falls away, leaving a small glowing orange crystal on Smash it! <laughs> I have a you question. Are, you're all out of initiative. What? I have a question. When it used its ability, would that have also affected the unconscious one? Oh boy, it would have. It, I have to make a lot of saves for a moment. One moment. Oh no. Uh, every person that's infected. Every guard. Yeah. yeah, that's why I was I was wanted, One, wanted to two, wait until three, after four, combat. Five, that's, why, that's why I was like wondering like six, mm. seven, eight. Yeah, no, don't worry. I I knew about that. I was just waiting <laughs> for the same reason. I need to make yeah. eight Constitution saving throws. Uh, anything below thirteen dies because they're already at zero. <laughs> One technically. No, I mean. No. Like, no, they're all unconscious. Unconscious. they're all unconscious. They're all unconscious. You guys non-lethal them and tied them up. Yeah, we non-lethal them. <laughs> right. Oh boy. Uh. Hey. Oof. Oh no. Five. Survive. So okay, this man okay, dies. Okay, I'm just gonna say this. 
It's mm. not our fault because we tried to keep them alive. If we yeah. had just cut out, killed them, three more would be dead. True. Uh, true. These three are dead. Oh. This one survives. I'll heal him. Maybe I should have locked that one. Probably, but um, it's too and late now. All right. Uh, two of these survived, and then this third one died. All right. Cool. I will heal the. The living ones, I'm just healing the 1 HP. They're still unconscious, but it's just a denotion of who the fuck survived. Man, I just imagine if, like, if they wake up before we find them, they're just gonna find themselves chained to dead people, tied up to dead people, and, and be like, ah! They had ah! crystals erupt out of them, yeah. Oh, fuck. Ah! Alright. I will go ahead and turn off the music. Uh, Wait, but... So we see what happens to this guy down here, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Crystals erupt out of him, and he kind of explodes. I hope that doesn't happen to everyone. Oh, oh I'm going to be honest, it probably will. Yeah, I, I think we should probably go check on them, huh? Yeah, but um... Uh, wait a moment before we go check gross. on them. I don't want to oh. look at it. Elium? Yep. Orange crystal thing over there. Big pointy stick. Whack. There is an orange crystal wait, sitting in the corpse of this thing. Shit, wait, wait, are we sure we want to destroy it? A hundred percent sure, yes. Yeah. But uh, just it... a quick thought though, what if we smash it and it just makes it spread in the more crystals? Yeah. Moon's going to take out her own, like, light hammer and walk over to this fucking thing. Uh -uh. <laughs> and she's gonna hit it. Wouldn't it be better uh, just to put it and... in something? Just oh, go as she does that, Orphe or Rhea <clears throat> heals away down here. All right. yeah, same. <laughs> Rhea and Orphe oh, fucking yeah, no, sprint moving. away. We are moving. <laughs> Every three of the party move. This guard's like, ah, oh, well, I feel so much better. And then you slam into the crystal. Get out of there! You slam into the crystal. Mm -hmm. It's no need. It is a stationary target that cannot resist. You can hit it as many times as you need. Um. It takes you a, f a few swings. It is very dense, even with the hammer. Uh, and eventually it cracks and breaks. And almost a sigh of relief spreads over the area. Minus the uh, dead guards. <laughs> and the panicking party members. <laughs> and the panicking so, party members. Uh, you you good up there? No, I'm dead. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're... Elected. Yeah, I, I feel very, um, you know, I think I need to eat something, or someone, <laughs> very much infected. Every, every step she takes, I, I take a step back. <laughs> um, yeah, who's the god at 7 HP doing? Uh, oh, he looks like he's doing fine. Like, he's hurt by the um, small amounts of poison damage and stuff he took, but overall, he's he's looking, he has no more crystals on him. Uh, I just, okay. you know. Actually, hold up one moment. I can change his token real quick. Right. So, uh, wait, where are any of the miners? Uh, the they miners. were all scrunched up inside of the big guy. Yeah. If you look over at the body of the, basically, the oh, yeah, crystal big right. suit, I, as I, I call forgot it, that detail. They, um, they, they were, like, compacted bodies. Like, they were far like, dead. What happened? Were they having like an orgy or something? Uh, it was being used as fuel somehow. I don't know. It, I honestly could not so tell no, you how this thing was doing what it was doing. We found this thing. I, I don't know. We found this thing and it just kind of. I don't know. It threw a line of crystals and that was the last thing I really remember. Well, uh, yeah, that... considering what happened to your friend, we might want to go check on all the other ones that we left. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, we tried to save a lot of them. We we are taking a walking. All right, yeah. One moment, um, I'm just trying to change his goddamn so he doesn't look like a crystal fuck boy anymore. Uh, are you sure he's not uh, just an Earth Denazi? Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, this would be uh, one hell of a way to are you all right? <laughs> Whatever, I'll I'll deal with it later. All right, um. He, he's gonna follow all of you, uh, and I will... Oh yeah, I have to move the torches one moment. So... Hey, well... <laughs> we, we did what we could to try to save people. Yeah, we are um... immediately untying. Damn, the one that was so difficult to kill!
Guard. <laughs> I'm so mad. Okay. Broccoli After guard. the fight you put up to not get hit, he fucking dies. Are you kidding me? Can we give that one like? I, I feel like that one deserves another con roll. <laughs> no. I'm sorry, but <laughs> legends die. <laughs> legends uh, I never die. Him as I legends past. never die. What are you talking about? Yeah, so out of this group, you can see only one survived. Yeah, yeah, that's one time. Can we, like, wake him up? Uh, he is currently unconscious with zero HP, so if you want to heal him, sure. But otherwise, yeah, you're just gonna have him. Uh, do you think him. anyone can carry him? Yeah, sure. There's another guard here. Rhea, do you want I'm me to drag gonna... you along? She might have stepped away. Ah, I will just drag them along. Of course, transportation. All right. Guard. Um, fast traveling. Fast travel. You know, I'm actually surprised that thing never managed to make a melee attack. Yeah, because we uh, away it just from it. It had it to, really have so many other things to do. To do. <laughs> yeah, it didn't have a reason to really. Like the melee attack would have been good had it, like, legitimately. I was expecting Measle to mental lock uh, Crystal Infection. Yeah, I was. I, was um, I went through a lot of things that I was thinking about. Like the first thing was spreading parasites, as well that I thought about. Uh, yeah. the crystal infection thing as well. But spreading parasites was higher up on the list because it didn't have a save. Yep. Uh, oh. Crystal soldier. Over here. It's being a little laggy. I'm trying to move things. Alright. Well. Um, I, I doubt you can carry them all. Uh, should you we start probably, dragging them? You can probably carry them uh, in pairs, right? Like, Coffee and Flavia take one, and Tristan and Question. take the other. Could the guard carry one? Yeah, absolutely. Um, Leave the guard, and carry another guard. Speaking of, uh, I'm just also going to be like keeping an extra eye out on this guy, seeing how he's coping. Uh, he's he's the is... only one awake. <laughs> he is like. like... It's pretty easy to see. He's kind of mortified because you just walked past the bodies of like five of his fellow guards. So he's he's not doing all right in the head, but he's he's Look, alive. We tried, okay. but our priority is getting them Look, out. We're coming. Uh, we're coming out with more people than we left off. Hey, buddy, <laughs> you are. You did save four guards, and I will add them to the town roster, which will help. But, hey, uh, buddy, uh, this is in no way your fault. You should know that. And, well, in the future, the mine is clear now. In the future, this this is not going to happen again. He just kind of sighs. If only we were more prepared or something. You are now. Look, you can't prepare for everything, unfortunately. No one's perfect. As much as I would love to be, we're not. And he'll, he'll kind of just pick up a guard and he'll start to move. Uh, all right, all right, and I'm assuming you all leave the mines, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, get me out of this hellhole, fuck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> get me out of this hellhole, fuck. All right. Uh, so I gotta open up the maps. Everyone bashing against this wall. <laughs> Getting infected by fucking rocks was not on the menu. Yeah, I do mediocre cartwheels. You guys, did you guys enjoy your first boss fight? Oh yes. That was yeah. I uh, very much wanted to use Psionics, and I did. Yes. The only thing I don't like about the boss fight is I couldn't make an arcane clash to uh, freeze its <laughs> head off and shatter it instantly. Take my head. <laughs> I need to work on that mechanic a bit before I reintroduce it. It's so fine. Yeah, I yeah. just uh, what what did it do again? The clash, it was based on your degree of success, but I like I don't have tables for it, so I would need tables and stuff. I wasn't it wasn't a super well thought out mechanic. Alright. Um how many cards are you mechanic? Fucking oh, wait, wait. Sorry. Like, what? I only see one corner of the map and it's just me and the dead people. And if you guys <laughs> left if you guys left <laughs> with all the dead yep. people. No, no, just 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 follow me. Sorry, follow I'm, me. I can't. every 
I'm assuming you guys were heading out of the mine, so I'm I'm porting yes. you guys. I I have to load a whole other map, and Steam Water map is a very long oh, load. There goes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, there we go. There right. you go. Sorry, it just finished loading. No, it's Fucking. okay. I was just like, um, did oh, I miss no. Orphe wouldn't have left you behind with dead people. Come oh. on. I didn't think so. <laughs> Um, was like, oh, maybe I really did do bad in this fight, and everybody's no. Like, <laughs> no. So how high? Or, how high is this wall again? Uh, it's like I think it was like ten feet tall. It's not Can a large. Can Flalia try to like get over it to go get help with getting the guards back to the city? Absolutely. I'm just gonna yank all oh. of them, including as the you, dead ones out here. You know, as you do start you to do that, the... Moon's just gonna make so... like a small staircase out of ice for you to just walk over the wall. Everybody just oh, walks up the fucking wall. Um, but yeah, basically, I'm, I'm going we're gonna, to like, the gate. <laughs> we're freaking running all the way to the, I think it was the barracks that was called. The barracks, yeah. I have the to, medic. I might have, I might have to reload Astral, because I just have a black screen. Uh, yeah, if you uh, need yeah, to. It's Again, it's a big-ass map, so I don't, I don't blame you. Yeah, no. Because, like, we, everyone are running in here, me. and we're gonna yell yeah. out, Fuck medic, yeah. fuck medic! <laughs> I don't know where you're running to, though. I don't see anything. There, uh, yeah. yeah. Go ahead. And, um, go ahead and people went Astral. straight over the wall. I'm going around. Okay, this part for me hasn't loaded yet. <laughs> uh, that part there is. is no wall. That's because there's nothing down there. I didn't think people oh. run all the way around the gate. I mean, a nice staircase is an easy way to end up with a broken. Neck. Yeah, you just walk through. You know the gate. what? There's like, there's guards down there, but they let you in. Yeah, <laughs> I, I I use the gate. <laughs> he uses the gate. Okay, well, the whole point of me going over was to try and get, like, the doctor and additional yeah. help. I wasn't uh -huh. thinking everyone was gonna oh, follow pause. her. Everyone pause. Rhea, as you step into the city, you feel the... of wild magic. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, you all hear a rumble and a sound from the central building. Oh, no, okay. What is... Oh! Sorry. <laughs> so, that's the one we're told to rise, right? The uh, Elderman's house? That's where no, not the Elderman's house, but the uh the, the meeting area where you did meet the Elderman oh, yeah, yeah, uh Bertanto. Yeah. Um, uh, the, the smoke house. Yeah, but one moment we're gonna Before, handle as that was as Rayo's entering, as Moon's here, Moon runs over or sorry, Moon and Flalia. Flalia, you get into the barracks, do you shout for the dock? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's up? What happened? I'll survive. We got a lot of people who are injured, and there's a lot of people who died. We need your help. <sighs> All right. We found we found your people. Well, that's good. Any of the miners survived? Oh. Any of the guards well, survived? They were all crunched up together inside of some weird crystal. Oh, that's fucked. <laughs> hey, oh, that's fucked. <laughs> <laughs> well, but we found, but we found <laughs> your guardsmen. A few of them, some of them died, some of them lived, and we need some help. All right, and over there, then he'll start making his way to the mine. Uh, everyone else may act now. You're heading somewhere. Moon, Moon's just gonna like look at Victoria. So I'm guessing you might care a bit for your guardsmen. Uh, of course. I mean, we've only got like eight left after the, after that. But I I heard the shouting. You found some of them. Four, to be exact. Uh. Nice. There were more we found, but the creature had an ability that was kind of like it killed off most of the people that were infected. Yeah, fortunate. Well, the doctor should be able to handle them. Um, I need to deal with this import order for all these weapons and armor as such. Uh, it's I just heard a rumbling from up there. Maybe you should go Look into that. I don't know what it yeah. could be, but uh... yeah, I'm about to do that. I was just in here and uh, wanted to tell you that. Now, who the fuck cast a spell? And uh, yeah, Moon's just gonna like start making her way right. in that direction. Rhea, what are you uh... doing after the rumble? Uh, right, you know what? She's <laughs> gonna like look around. <laughs> She doesn't see anything, right? Yeah, you don't see anything. It's not it's nothing like obvious. You just heard a rumble. She's just gonna kind of head towards the rumble. 
All right, you can move yourself towards the uh, the townhouse. I'm gonna wait here. Murdoch is gonna like go ahead and start like pulling the bodies apart and like moving the guards up the ice staircase <laughs> carefully. Those that survive. Orpheus just kind of making a jingle to keep the 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 guard that's a, alive and conscious entertained while we're waiting for the doctor to arrive. <laughs> uh, the doctor has gotten here. He's started separating yeah. the bodies and stuff. Well, this was this was before he got here. Like uh, I wanted to say it, but everybody was doing stuff. So yeah, I told him. My bad. A lot going on. Shake my head. You need to talk faster, Noodle. There it is. Everybody needs to shut up for two seconds. <laughs> Jesus Christ! What? I'm fighting. I'm fighting I'm or I'll fighting. kill all of you. I'm, I'm not fighting. fighting. Fight you. <laughs> Time to fight you to roll me a 1d20 right now. No. no. Oh, no. Um, Moon roll oh, the I think lose lost the fight. That fight. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to roll on Astral's. Oh. There's a, there's a <laughs> no, d20 no, button. Uh, apparently you did win. <laughs> Wait, there's a d20 button? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there is. <laughs> yeah, there's like basic, basic buttons. Jesus Christ, mm, Lord Almighty! So Let's go. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna chase after my sister. All right, you can chase after your sister, Elnia and Falia. What do you guys do? Uh, yeah, I was, I was staying with the soldiers while the doctor was making it his way here, and I guess I'd follow up to the right. group. You may go ahead and move yourself, Falia. What are you doing? She is mostly just going to be sticking with the doctor. She's not the strongest, but she figures she can help with something else, probably. All right. Yeah, he's going to just basically, for a while, he's going to be getting these people, like, over the ice wall with the help of the living guard, sorting the bodies out, and then, like, the, these bodies are horrific, by the way, because crystals exploded out of them and kind of tore open their organs and other things. Yeah, I figured they were shredded. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're looking at... Yeah, you're looking at sausage pre getting put into a into a container type thing is what you're looking at. Boy. Alright. You help the doctor. In the meantime. Me. Yeah. Sorry, it takes me a while to cross the city. It's a big fucking map. Come on. Oh, dude. <laughs> is it smoky in here? Uh, it's dusty. Else. And Vertonten will run up behind you, having heard all this. There is no there is no smoke, oddly enough. Uh, Taladra will be kind of looking in here like, what the fuck just happened? Um, Taladra, do you have any idea what just happened? Not Did at you all. Do something? I, just, no, I was just sitting here and I heard a, a loud crash from the next room um the next room you say yeah, through the door yeah all right we're just gonna walk up and uh all right you know we're just gonna open the door we're not even gonna knock all right you open the door uh you see if i can grab it a death slot roll initiative <laughs> all of you die roll new character no i'm just kidding no. No. It's just a meteor storm. It's not that bad. Uh, the, through the... Guys, it's a flump. Oh, no. Through this. I hope this doesn't come out too large. Please. It will. No, actually, it should be perfect size. Once it decides to that? show up. Yeah. Did it show up that? for you all? Yeah, it is. All right. the there is a large hole in the ground. Whole thing? <laughs> yep, there's a large hole in the ground. Um, Through the foundations. Is there a similar hole in the roof? Nope. Okay. Um, Sorry. As Tristan, and, <laughs> as Tristan and Moon walk up to the edge of this hole, and Vertonten enters and starts following, uh, and Taladra will also step around, uh, you can see mounds and mounds of gold down there. Holy. <laughs> uh, I think it seems Vertanten. like the town was struck with a bout of good luck. Vertanten. Uh, I just realized I was muted, but... Uh... <laughs> I'm, uh, hold on. I'm going to tell Vertanten to not get closer. I'm going to grab right. a chair. I'm going to put it down here. Vertanten, take a seat and look down. 
<laughs> he will walk over, take a seat, and look down. Jesus, that's a lot of gold. Indeed. Just... Rhea's gonna look, and then she's gonna double look, <laughs> and then she's gonna ripple, and she's gonna turn into like an old mining man, and she's gonna be like, hot jiggity! And then she's gonna look for Orpheus. So I have a question, Rhea. Uh huh. Is is it like one of the bodies of the miners we saw? No. No. Okay. Because I'm about to say, like, just looking at a miner when they were all like. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, it's just a random miner. Probably someone yeah, that came to the show. Like one of the yeah. seven fucking gnomes or dwarves. Yeah, it's one of the seven dwarves. And she just oh, goes, no. hot jiggity! And she lays flat on the ground. And is there something. You know what? She reaches into her, her own pocket, she takes out a gold piece. Mm hmm. And he just drops it onto the pile. All right, drop it onto the pile. How oh, far down is it gold? Uh, it is only fifteen feet down. <laughs> oh, only? Yeah, it's really close. Um. Do not jump down there, please. <laughs> oh, okay. I was uh, about if... to say if Rhea looks like if Rhea looks like she's about to jump down there, I want to grab um, her ankle. <laughs> uh, to a like a normal size. Kill you. Like, a normal-sized human could basically, like, extend their arms down from the top of the pit, um, like, hold themselves into the pit from the top of the pit with their arms, and not take fall mm -hmm. damage. It's that, it's that cool. I... Yeah. I wanna... I, know, I can't really get out. Could... Had, does one of you have any means to get one of those? I want to see if they're Oh, real. I can do that. Hold on. And her mage hand comes out. It okay. goes down and picks up a couple and then comes back. Yeah, absolutely. All right. A fistful is of gold. Is this full on like gold coins or is yes. this like pure gold? Yes, it Can is. I, with the magnifying glass I have, uh, All right. investigate. <laughs> you may investigate <laughs> them, Measle. Go for it. Rab brings up oh, the. Uh, it's actually a stroke of bad luck. It's all fake money. Twenty three. We get reported. These are real yeah, gold I... coins. At least the the bunch that has been grabbed are all real gold coins. Oh boy. Guys, we is, found the pirate uh, treasure. Can I get yeah. a general idea of how much is down there? Uh, roll me a general perception check. I'll say. All right. Just to kind of take like take in all of it. Uh. My perception is nothing special. This used to be a pirate Boy. city. <laughs> Five. There's a lot. That's all you can really tell. You can see some platinum and some silver and some uh, copper mixed in. And you see one, at the very top, you see one blue coin. I swear to God, if it's an Electrum, I'm gonna fight you. Um, Rhea, could you get that one? Uh, the blue one. Uh, yeah, hold on. We and found the one piece, out, fuck you. She reaches out her hand, and her mage hand, like, stretches, stretches, and it grabs it. Alright, grab it. Bring it up. Mm -hmm. Alright. <clears throat> the blue coin is brought up. Do you look at it, Kristen? Yes, sir. Everyone. Take a very close look. Alright. Uh, this is a good find. This is a cobalt coin. Uh, now, most people don't want to carry these around or store them because these are worth 100 gold and nobody really wants to lose 100 gold in one coin. But, Jesus. It's worth 10 platinum, essentially. It is the tier <laughs> above platinum is cobalt. Boy. Oh, oh I was hearing cobalt, like, you know, the race. That's what no. I heard. God damn it. <laughs> No, cobalt, no, like the fire, ore. And I was like, cobalt. what the fuck is cobalt? cobalt? Yes, I, I get it now. I get it now. <laughs> yeah. um, no, it's not a cobalt coin, though these might all belong to a cobalt. You don't know. So, so you know, we've, we've been in this city for, like, a single day. Elium's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not buying any of this. <laughs> things like, um, things like that don't just happen. So, actually, to Orphe, they do. And while this has never happened okay. to her... Yeah? She Rhea? Had, uh, Rhea. Yes, yeah. Rhea. Sorry, I was looking at Orphe's token. <laughs> so, um, and having felt the click of the wild magic as she enters the city, she kind of like, it takes her a long time, and she's like totally Scrooge McDucking, like, 
she, her mage hand is like dumping gold coins on her. Like <laughs> she's like laying on the ground. Making <laughs> yeah, she's she's Scrooge McDucking whatever coins her gold her mage hand can scoop up and dump on her. She's nice. making it rain. Lots of oh, gold coins are being dropped. There is a lot a of coins here. Can we see the bottom of this? Uh, I was no, about the... to say. So Go ahead. the bottom of this pit is covered with coins. That we is... can't really tell how deep it goes. No, there is a lot of coins here. So, so well. Uh... Um. Well, I, I think we have I enough think... money to afford decent beds now. Mm -hmm. And Moose is gonna start walking. How, how late is it? Uh, you've only been in there for you've been in there for less than an hour. So it was like what? It was four or something when you went in, or five something. It was like five ten or something. So it it's maybe been fifteen minutes at most through clearing the mines. Brutal fifteen minutes, but only only that much. Yeah, uh, yeah. We're gonna go to the mine, check it out, and be right back. Fifteen yeah. minutes later. Where are those adventurers? Are... Oh uh, shit, they're yeah, back. They brought people back. We've been in this town for like a, a total of uh, maybe five or four hours. Five hours, or yeah. 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 <laughs> we are the stroke of good luck. Guys, <laughs> we're going to build a shrine to the luck god. It's paid off. That's exact. Uh, that's exact. Oh, was it? No, well, you guys didn't bring a, build a shrine to. My art is um, prosperity. <laughs> It's prosperity yeah, in right. nature. Wait, this Sorry, is prosperity. We are going to build one to the prosperity god. Yeah. This, this, I call it's this prosperity. Your intent. I am very on board with Mayara. Um, yeah. The, uh, yeah so, to, gonna... just... Oh, real quick, I just want to read. Oh, this is what the wording of the surge was. The next town you visit is blessed with good fortune, more resources, or disaster averted. That was the, sur oh. that was the hidden surge you rolled. Oh, so she... even if we failed that boss fight, it's like, yeah. Yeah, as long as she got back in. <laughs> yeah. It's like all of us die and the town suddenly yeah. becomes super rich. <laughs> well, it was it was the next town she visited, so as long as yeah. she got, got back into town. Uh, yeah. She's gonna kind of, like, stop and she's gonna be like, okay, oh, one moment. um, You're not here. you guys. Alright. I have a secret I have to tell you. Was this said towards? Oh, are Everybody? we sharing secrets now? Um, well, yeah, this is kind of a big one. Bertanton will look. Does it have to do with... A lodge will look? Like, should we I be don't. in the room for this? Um, well, I mean, no, but no, probably Lodger not. Goes, the lodger leaves. He's respectful <laughs> enough. Bertanton will think for a moment. Green's just gonna stare at him like... He'll approach leave. and then he'll he'll walk out. He'll leave. Smart choice. Okay. Um. So sometimes my magic can do really really good things, like this. And she points to the giant hole and the the gold angel she's been making <laughs> and everything else. Um. But Someone's sometimes. Like... Go ahead. Moon like walks over, looks in there, looks at you, looks in there, <laughs> and just walks back. <laughs> See, she's having a hard time believing this right now. But um, sometimes my magic does like really, really bad things, like um, can hurt you or make you sick. Um, but I don't do it on purpose. Or burn down an entire circus tent. <gasps> that was only one time. You Just burnt down. It. How often does this happen? Wait a moment. Um, when everyone got hit, hey Doom, what was the damage everyone took? Yeah, actually, like, uh, it was a like? it was force damage. It was a pulse of arcane energy. It was a little chaotic, so it was hard to nail down exactly where it came from. But it definitely pulsated out from this kind of the center of the battlefield. All right. So wait, that wasn't you that caused the like. The small amount of force thing. Was um, it? you mean the bubble that kind of burst in the middle of the field? And yeah, that that was me. I'm sorry. How often uh... does this happen? Uh. And you see, 
once again, like when she asked how many minutes, she just starts counting on her fingers. And she runs out of fingers, and so she makes more fingers. And she's like, <laughs> it happens fingers. a lot. <laughs> um, anytime I use my magics, well, my big magics, not my little magics. <laughs> like, I can do this. And she snaps her fingers and prestigitates, like, a wispy fucking cloud of pink smoke. So, like, Moon's gonna, like, like to Moon's gonna snap her <laughs> fingers and, like, create a 20-sided dice. And she's <laughs> just gonna, like, roll it on the ground and just go, like, so every time you cast magic, it's basically just a game of chance that extremely good things will happen or extremely bad things could happen. Um, sometimes nothing happens. That's mildly concerning. Yeah. However, I mean, it also it, sounds fun. It hasn't killed you yet, so it can't be that horrible. You haven't no. killed anyone of that, have you? Uh, no. <laughs> the longer it took you to answer, the more concerned the look on Moon's face got. Morphe incites their sister, damn, they kill yeah. someone with wild magic. <laughs> I can't. Well, she goes, I've killed people, like, um, no, I haven't killed anybody with it. Not yet, anyway. I don't really want to. I feel like that would be mean. Let's not be counted among, the, uh, among those numbers. <laughs> Alright, then. Um, and that's, your case. That's my is sister. there anybody else with any uh, grandiose secrets? Uh, and Nim I mean, to aren't there only also like only two or like three or four of you there? There's five. Everybody but you. Would do you want to head okay. over there, Amuna? No, she's she's gonna be helping the doctor because remember she can use a healer's kit and she promised. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so yeah, and Nim's uh, walking to the hall and mm -hmm. he's going to take a silver coin from his pouch. And throw it onto the pile, mm -hmm. and then uh, he's just going to say, uh, "Yeah, I'm going to check on the wounded." And walks out. I will say we uh, probably should reconvene tomorrow and talk about our budget. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. For now, I'm going to go rest. I am going to do a back bend and be like, "I can do this." <laughs> oh no. And then start walking around like the fucking exorcist girl. Oh, nice. <laughs> Still crawling around. Well, I I, uh, I feel like I killed it with that one. Uh, not a lot of people want to share the secrets, huh? <laughs> I already shared my secret. What's yours? Um, I actually have two eyeballs. What? No. You're lying. I mean, he's been wearing good eye patch the entire time. He has an eye patch over one yeah. of his eyes. Yeah, Wait, I just why? assumed you didn't have an eyeball because you're wearing an eye patch. Why do you have an eye patch? Uh, my other eye looks uh strange. It's a different color. Or if he does the posted a gif. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> not gonna, not gonna, not gonna pry into that. I hate it. <laughs> it's goat all over again, Doom. Oh no! Disgusting. <laughs> oh god. You not have bones in your body. <laughs> a six foot tall elf just fucking contorts themselves. That's terrifying. <laughs> like the <laughs> the video of a human doing it is what's scary, but not the elf. Uh, human uh, doing. Uh, it. Does this Ugh. concern you, sir? <laughs> does it concern you? <laughs> Sorry, what'd you say, Ray? All right. No, I was waiting to see if Tristan was gonna share his secret. Oh, he did. He did. What? He had two eyes. One of them's a different color. Oh. Lame! Hey, man, nobody asked Listen, him that I wanted to see has, it. <laughs> that man has the shotting gun, okay? I don't know yeah. what you're talking about. <laughs> Fucking Rinnegan. Rinnegan! Alright, I think we're going... I think we're going to and... sleep. <laughs> Alright, and... Nobody we'll... asked if they wanted to see it. So, nope. Rhea, Orphe... Uh, okay, Rhea, Orphe, Tristan, just as I'm wrapping up this part. Uh, are you guys going to, to head to the barracks and sleep? 
I am going to head to the barracks and make a report. And write down everything to... Like, every single step I can think of to uh, keep the mines safe, keep them, like, uh, crystal free and everything, and then Got it. other threats that could possibly... Like, anything I can think of. So, uh, you would know, because of all of your really good rolls on all of the information checks, uh, in general, the mines will remain crystal free now, and all of the corrupted crystals should have gone back to normal. Um, uh, and it's just a general mining hazard that you might come across another, um, another like, infection crystal. But at that point, uh, now that mines are pretty clear and the, the miners, well, the, the guard and the miners would know what to look for now, uh, and... There's probably no other weird circumstances that will happen around this crystal. You, again, you don't know why it took the form of a giant crystal creature and tried to beat your ass. But assuming that doesn't happen, it should be easy enough to deal with when it arises Wait, before the crystal plex. I know why it happened now. I do you know what, what happened? Years ago. Oh, no. <laughs> Rhea rolled oh, out a ma wild magic result. Years ago. The next mine you walk into, the enemies will be ten times tougher. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. Years ago. We entered the mines. That's why it was oh, weird. Right. Think about it. It makes complete character in, like, it makes complete sense in character because of what just happened. Oh my god. Oh All right. my god. Rhea, uh, no, Rhea would go help with the, with the soldiers. All right. She's not very much help, but yeah, she's um, here. Moving over to Falia, Rhea, and Elmium. That was it, right, uh, Nizel? And then you're heading uh, to sleep, or are you? Yeah, no, just off? like also in general, like everything they need, because most of the miners are dead, and we mm -hmm. need new ones. Just setting up like uh, base rules of safety for them to follow. Got it. Uh, Victory would tell you that she is going to send some of her guards in there to find whatever gold is there, which basically means that. You will all get 200 gold. Not like, I mean, collectively, the city will earn 200 gold as this month's payment from the mines, because it was backlogged no. by the crystals. Uh, no, Moon would probably just go with them to show them, just it. to make sure nothing else is in there, you know, in case people yeah. get. In that is something games. you can do easily enough. There is nothing else in the mines. You have thoroughly cleared them out. Uh, over here to the Orphe, Rhea, Elnium, and Flalia. Uh, Doc Murdoch is trying to uh, tend to the wounds. This guard is just going to go to the barracks. He's he's tired. He's out. He's gone. Uh, but the rest of them... Uh, there are three unconscious guards here, and five dead ones. Uh, so the first order of business is make sure these people survive. Mm-hmm. Uh, Luckily, they're only unconscious, so he's just set them up. At the moment, he's just set them up on makeshift stretchers and kind of just left them there to, you know, wake up naturally, since they don't seem to be in plague anymore. Uh, after which, he'll look at everyone here. So, uh, any good at digging graves? Uh, I have some experience. Uh... I've never dug a grave, but I can dig a hole. Alright, well, I'll walk away for a bit, head into the barracks, come back with a bunch of shovels, start climbing over. How long does the ice stairway last? Uh, the ice just lasts until, uh, I don't think there's a set amount of time on how long it lasts. It's just there until someone right. gets rid of it, I believe. You I'll just... go double check right now. All right, well, assuming that's true, he will cross and he will look and he'll say, I don't have a graveyard, so just got to dig here, I guess. And he'll start digging. Wait, this place doesn't have a graveyard? It does not. Yeah, all of its We're bodies go out. <laughs> out to sea. Okay. It's the least yep, important out thing. It, yeah, no it's either out to sea, take a tide, or, uh, or buried. That's it. That's a genuine thing people do in the Navy as well, like open yeah. sea burials. Fair, fair, that is fair. Yeah. I just found a picture I mean, of Lee dodging what's someone. What's the, uh, the custom for this town, then, is to send them out to sea. 
Well, it's it's not always to send them out to sea. Generally, it depends. Um, because they can send them out to sea, but that's not the normal. It's just what's done if there's too many bodies and they don't have the time to, to bury them. But since there's a, you know, they have the time to bury them at the moment, they will bury them. All right, so where have they been burying their dead if they don't have a grave? Just outside the walls. Then let's, are, are, like, anywhere outside the walls or in one specific area? Um, insofar, it just seems generally outside the walls. They've been burying. That's why he's just come over the wall and started digging. Okay. No. No, he needs to organize it. <laughs> like that really unorganized rim world colony. I, moon would like... Like, I'm not there, so I can't say anything. Yeah. You aren't. That is correct. Alright. Elniam is digging. Rhea doesn't know any better, so... Yeah. Alright, are you gonna help dig? Yep, yeah. up over the thing and help dig. Alright. Um... And Flalia, you guys also gonna help dig, or are you guys just there? My assumption would probably be Flalia would prefer to keep tending to the injured. Okay, but, yeah, you can stand watch over them and make sure that they're all okay. Sometimes giving them sips of water and stuff. Yeah. Uh, there's no time limit, am I just, uh, like, I double-checked, I read it twice? Yep, that's fine. I mean, the probably guards will probably break it down, because eventually the guards will probably break it down, because it's not good to have a, uh, stairwall, stairway over their walls in the middle of the wall. <laughs> kind of invalidates can the I... point of a wall. <laughs> Did I break my own eyes? Let me look at that. Uh, uh, dig, diggy hole. Diggy, diggy Orphe's, hole. Orphe's, yeah, Orphe's gonna go help Rhea dig holes. All right. uh, it takes a, a bit, though you do have shovels, so with the doctor's help and Elnium and Rhea and Orphe, it takes maybe 30 minutes. These are not deep graves, these are shallow graves, because they don't have a oh, proper boy. graveyard. Oh god, that's even worse. <laughs> Like, that part actually bothers me, like, the there's a reason- the mind, like, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm in the mind, but, like, jeez. This town is not up to code whatsoever. I, okay, I mean, you know, I can't, I can't really tell them otherwise, you know, I'm not there, but yeah. <laughs> they're doing it away from the mind, right? <laughs> uh, uh, about 60 feet away from the mine. <laughs> Boy. Uh, they will just eventually, over time, unless anyone says anything differently, they will just dig up and put the bodies in graves, and the doctor will come over the wall. Yeah, Elium will uh, say a prayer to Myra. Uh, Myara. Myara. Yeah. Myara. Myara the savior. He is the yeah, general yeah. deity of Myra. The one we, we dedicated an yes. altar to. Yeah. yeah, the one that you're going to uh, have a shrine built to. Alright. Pray to Mayara. And then come over the wall. Tokens. They have been... Uh, before we all go away, after they're buried and whatnot, she would play a song for... She would play a song once they're buried. Kind of okay. like sending them off. Ah, singing okay. for the dead now, are we? I mean, she did come here to sing for ghosts. Yeah, that's yeah, not true. Quite literally. Oh no, it is a ghost town. Fuck. Um, seeing Flalia throw a tune, Orphe would join in with right. a liar. Go ahead and roll me performance checks, both of you. Flalia, your tune is somber but uh, acceptable. Wow, nine. Uh, you can help if you wish. Yes, with my flute. All right. Yes. Morphe, you may roll at advantage instead. Oh, I don't have to or, roll. Oh, yes. Uh, it's if you want to help, if you want to use the help action, then you can, or you can roll and take the sixteen. It's up to you. Oh, I'll just take. I'll just take the sixteen. Just, just yeah, just take the sixteen. <laughs> yep. All right. I'm a little rusty for my travels. Sorry. <laughs> Everybody is. Mm-hmm. Or if he just, or not, or if Rhea just copies Flalia. 
copy Flalia and improve upon it. And as the tune sets over and the soldiers start to wake up and make their way to the barracks, um, you all will level up to level two. Dum, dum, dum. Boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Can now, we can either you? level up now, if it matters for you, uh, or you guys can level up after session, and we can move on to kind of... Because I know, at the very least, Moon wanted to talk about a budget now that you have a fair amount more gold to spend. Yeah, if if, if people tell Flalia, she wants to as well. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. Question no, yeah, of, definitely would have let we, everyone are we, know. Who... Are we going for, like, another 30 minutes? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's that's when session should end. So we can okay. we can probably get through the uh, budget meeting. I would I would. I mean, if there's no other like combat stuff. I mean, I'm willing to wait till after session to level. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there. I mean, I I don't have any more combat encounters planned. So. <laughs> I would like to fight victory. No, All right, she it whoops up your ass time. next. Oh, she whoops okay. your ass next. <laughs> All right. Guys, she was victorious. <laughs> all right, you may all heal up uh, as you take yeah. a long rest. I'm assuming, unless you guys want to do something. Nope. I am sleeping at a uh, you know normal time to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I assume we would say to meet at the town hall. I guess the next day. Yeah, got it. So um, wait, what time stamp did they say to me? Uh, I don't day. think they gave a time stamp because none of them have clocks. Hey, yep. I'll, I'll give them a time stamp and I'll, I'll just give them like. Well, you're all sleeping watch. in the same barracks, <laughs> like, so. <laughs> okay, I'll just tell rocket. them to follow me. <laughs> all right. Uh, I'll go there right? when it's time. Question: Is everyone attending the meeting, or is somebody yeah. st- staying out? I think everybody's attending. Yep, I'm just I making hope. sure. Right. Gonna Good with Mommy, but Orphe will go anyway, because her sister's going. <laughs> Economy. Economy, indeed. I'm one sheet of parchment down. Got it. Rhea's only going because she's curious. She doesn't know. Like, she's not good with numbers. That's yeah, Orphe and Rhea are not good with numbers. They're just going to go. <laughs> Orphe's also going to be like, what is this about? What do you mean town meeting for Nito, budget? How, Nito, how early did you drag us here? Uh, Probably 8 a.m. No. Oh. Not early at all. Right? Moon's just going to no, knock that's on not the door. Early. Like, I was hoping early. it was like 6 a.m. Daybreak exactly. Nice. I think I think Orphe and Rhea would be norm would be used to being up that early, huh? Yeah, I mean, yeah. I just feel uh, like eight a.m. after everything has done their morning stuff. Yeah. yeah. Uh, what were you saying, Elmi? Um, oh, just that he was probably awake, like at yeah at daybreak. Yeah, I got you. All right. Uh, as the all right, my level is done already. Anyway, you may all go ahead and enter. Uh, the place, and Philodra will kind of get the door as she notices you all start to enter, and she'll just say, go on through, he's waiting. May all. Wait, yeah, my seat was over here last time. <laughs> uh, for once, Vertanton doesn't smell like horrible smoke. He, he still smells Ooh. kind of like smoke, because, you know, he's suffused with <laughs> the stuff, but it's it's less <laughs> powerful. We all went to the same seat. So. <laughs> You. Still you know, Moon's, Moon's gonna like look at him. I'm gonna roll a odd, odd Moon cast it. Moon, Moon's just gonna like not cast Presty this time because it's more <laughs> bearable. Uh, but she looked like she was really considering it. Can Red I just did. real quick? What'd you say, Amiam? Uh, can I just uh, check the hole just to see yeah. if anything changed? Uh, there is still just gold at the bottom of the hole. Um, you notice that some of it, se- the gold pile seems to be s- smaller. Uh, okay. But it seems like it's kind of starting to get stacked over here. Like, it seems like somebody, or people have been kind of pulling gold up out of the hole and stacking it. 
uh, I will add it to the pile, the gold ingots that I got, got in the mine. Uh, okay, so you're adding the gold ingots in. Uh, did I give you a price for those? I can't remember. Uh, two ingots worth. That's it. Two <laughs> ingots worth. Oh, okay. uh, did I give you a weight on them? Uh, nope. All right. Uh, <laughs> man, just, just makes them up. Us. Uh, each ingot would be worth 50 gold, say. So they are gold ingots. All right. Now. All right. Uh, with this, Vertantum will kind of look over to all of you. So, uh. That happened. Here you've cleared out the mine. Yes, that's uh, one problem dealt with. Uh, all oh, counted. Uh, several. Uh, did you guys put the cobalt coin back in the pile, or do you just have it? Um, I would have tossed it back, yeah. Okay. Uh, all counted, there's probably about somewhere in the range of 600 to 800 gold down there. Including all of the fun stuff, like that bluish coin. Uh, plus the mine funds. Oh, it's said Funds, 200. Seems you've all got a... As of this... Random stroke of luck. It seems like you've all got about a, a thousand gold to spend on the town again. And we have 25 left over from the first time. Yes. You're currently, uh, if you count the ingots which you have found, which is 100, the 200 from the mines, the 700, because that's overall, like after counting it, that would fully counting it, that's what it comes out to 700 gold. Uh, you have another thousand gold. Uh, the building list is mostly the same. I will update it in just a moment because there are a yeah, few I'm gonna, things. I'm also going to copy paste what we did last time. Yep, got it. Five gold graveyard. Come on. So this is what we did the first time. It's a little bit more than five gold for a decent graveyard. Yes. <laughs> like, I don't plan on having people die. We have to at least honor the dead. Oh yeah, that's right. We got automated uh, fishing done. Well, you purchased not it, but seeing as it's been in a day, not done. Yeah, we've, we've, yeah. we've only been here for. Like, <laughs> we we basically bought a what you call it person that works with it. Yeah, you you basically or, hired an artificer and he will come and uh, repair the things and stay to maintain them for a, a price every month. Uh, yeah. Oh boy, guys, we can. We're starting adventures in Remnant now. You can go to Remnant and not instantly die in a mission. You guys did quite well in that fight. Alright. Uh, there we go. It's updated with the miscellaneous stuff that has been added. A graveyard for 50 GP, a gravekeeper who basically tends to it for 20 GP a month, but he is, you know, he'll basically come and he'll tend to the graves and make sure the, the like, rites and rituals that need to be uh, done to the graves to ensure that they don't rise as undead are done. Um... Or a moratorium, which is a big ass. It's like you know, the, it's the big graves with the mausoleum. Where did you put this it. stuff? Uh, I edited it to the normal thing that is now in the pin. So glass, or not glass roller, no. Team water roller. I edited it into the pins of the uh, the building list. Okay, that's uh, it's one thousand twenty five GP total to you for a meeting too. Memoriam? Wait, hang on. What's moratorium? That yeah. Is that just a memoriam, basically? It's like a bigger graveyard with mausoleums and stuff. It's not just graves anymore. It has, like, the buildings where you entomb caskets. The fancy graves. Yeah. Uh, so we could put the 200 GP in the mine now that it's safe-ish. Oh, oh, let me see. One last thing. Oh, me... Update. Yeah. That is... Falls under production, which is uh, miners, because you will need them. Yeah. 
pay our 50 GP to hire a batch of miners. Yeah. I assume for a month. Uh, it's not per month. It's like the first payment, and then the rest of the payment is covered by the uh, gold earned from the mine. Okay. So wait, do we need to pay for a new mine, or...? No, you don't have to pay for a new mine. You have oh. one mine, but you have no miners. Okay. We could get a second okay. mine if we needed to. Yes, you could start uh, excavating a second mine to earn more passive income. So pro we probably want okay. to start with the miners at, at the very yeah, least. Yeah, so Flally is going to pull out her notes from before, because she wrote all of this down from nice. last time. <laughs> and she's going to be, all right, so we did a bunch for the guards. There's the farm. We're going to get houses, the fishing, and a little shrine. What else should we add now? I have a, one more question, Doom. Yes. Uh, what are her current stats or whatever? Uh, currently, it's the same. Um, you are currently, uh, because you, it hasn't actually been upgraded yet, you have two walls, one docks, zero merchants, one guards, one production, zero factory, zero technology, one housing and manpower, and one shrine for religion. Um, uh, well, you don't have the shrine miners? yet, but... Uh, with the upgrades you have obtained, you would get uh, two. You would get up to guards four because you would you got three upgrades for the guards. You would get production two because you're buying a farm. Uh, production three because you're at automated fishing. Housing two because you got um more houses and then religion you get. So your guard stat will be four. Uh, I'll just go ahead and edit this real quick to include it, even though it hasn't occurred yet. Guard stat will be at 4, production will be at 3, housing and manpower it will be at 2. Okay, so, question. Uh, if we bought oh, more uh, miners, would that add some manpower at all, or not? Uh, no. So, the what that would do is that would basically maintain the production, because currently the mine is like, the the mine is currently empty, so at the moment it's giving zero production, so technically you should be at production two, not three, but I'm assuming that you'll pay for miners, in which case it will be it will go back up to production three. Mm hmm Because the mine is useless without miners. Yeah, we're, we're, we'll buy some miners probably. Yeah, so we definitely yeah, um, want miners. Then we... Like guard okay. supply? Uh, Just is... supplies for the guards? We, that's oh. what we've been buying. <laughs> In so far, they've got guard training, guard weapons, guards. and guard oh, towers. Okay. We, we, oh, wanted the, we wanted the Taven, eventually. The uh, what? Tier 2 guard the, training? The Taven. The, the, uh, what? For, for the two higher uh, adventurers and stuff. The oh, the tavern. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, you to construct well, since we got some more, should we see if we can get the market up and going a little bit? That would get more people coming through town. Yeah, that too. Corpus Isn't tools. that what the tavern, uh, what would the tavern do? Uh, the tavern brings adventurers, which brings uh, people that you can hire to go do things, and also uh, rumors that you can follow as kind of small story plots. Um, basically, right. random adventures that you can go on uh, to earn gold or other rewards. Um, or to earn allies for your town, etc. And, you know, people would be slightly less depressed. <laughs> yeah, because well, they have somewhere to go. It also see, provides, it can also provide a passive income, but it does, you do have to pay for alcohol, so whether it makes a profit or loses a profit will be determined one. Oh man, if only we had people that could play music in the bot, um, in the tavern. <laughs> if only they had guards. If they or used downtime. Players. If only had generalized performers. <laughs> oh no. Whatever will we do? Okay, we were also talking about a graveyard, right? Mm hmm. Okay, oh, just making sure that because Flora, Flora Flora would note down anything that we discuss. So. Yeah. All right, so I believe someone mentioned proper stores. Yeah. Yes. That is something we probably want to invest in if we're going to have people coming to the town. Yeah, we are. Are you also wanting to try to do the tavern? Yeah. The tavern, yes. Need so a reason for people to want more than just stores. That's 550. So let me so, show you what we're at right now discussing all of this. 
Yeah, okay. So we don't have much left. You have another 175 gold left. I was thinking uh, maybe the forge. Why uh, not that's we, we need a forge? As a note, or are we on a... um, to explain some of the other buildings, because I know I, I forgot to explain some of them. Um, the Arcanium is basically like spell scrolls. Uh, it's, it's production for spell scrolls or other magical things. Uh, the Orrery in technology uh, allows you to make new spells. Um, Excuse me, what, what does make Woodworker, I feel, is important. <laughs> woodworker is also good. It helps, it decreases the cost for, like, housing and stuff, because you're just harvesting the stuff around here, and it allows you to kind of uh, make smaller wooden things that you might need. So, like, arrows no longer cost money monthly, etc., like that. So, how much, how much gold do we have left? 175. I added woodworker in as a possibility. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, uh, so did... what what do we have right now, exactly? Because I uh, wasn't here for the first session. I posted just... an oh. outskirts rolling what we already bought. Yeah, yeah, that's what right, they so bought. First meeting. How, how many? Um, houses you can look in the uh, page as well. I know, but like, how many houses is that? Uh, housing one is basically enough housing for like to match one production. Um. The good thing is that one of your production at the moment is uh, is automated via the automated fishers, or once they get back up running. So currently, you have enough housing to kind of run the um, the uh, the boats, which I mean, we have. could just we and could then... just save the last bit of money we have. We don't have to spend all of it. Yeah, probably a good idea. In case we have just because it's early on, it helps to have as much as you can. Yeah, but if we have an emergency or something and we don't have any money to fix that emergency, we're going to get fucked. Mm -hmm. If we're sitting at this currently, there'd be 75 GP left. We can be preemptive instead of doing the woodworker stuff. Uh, I will could just make... Yeah, the woodworker's 100. Sorry, it was the Arcadian. We, we don't have any guard supplies or armor, right? Uh, we got we already ordered... Well, right? They yeah, ordered guard supplies is already here. There, yeah, yeah, there's... Oh right, those are... okay. I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see it, I see it. I see it. It's in this one. Supplies is it. in the current one. Yeah. Uh, so the only thing that we okay. don't have for the guards is the armor. better armor. Yeah, and guard training too, which is basically right. will help you get. You'll be getting guards that sometimes rise to the rank of like knight level. Like you'll be getting the stronger guards, the ones that'll be able to you know handle things. Around the city, <laughs> why it's expensive. And all we have left is you said seventy-five gold. Seventy-five GP. If we get everything that we're talking about. Yes. Yeah. I mean, there's not really much else. I don't think. Yeah, that uh, I, would... I feel is like necessary unless we wanted to make another shrine. I feel maybe like the wood... uh, one hundred. Our on there. Yeah, the... Would be a good like emergency fund. So yeah. maybe um, that's a good start. Doom, if yeah. with the tavern a bunch of people are going to come here with horses and we, <laughs> and we don't have stables. Yeah. Is yeah, that no, stable? There is a, for the tavern, there is a small stable included, uh, depending on where you, like, want it. Like, like the, the small stable will be uh, adjacent to the, the tavern, so that'll come with it. Oh, yeah. Um, but if you put it outside, if you put the tavern outside the walls, it will have a bigger stable. But it's also more vulnerable to getting fucked. No. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's Why would not. we put it outside? <laughs> no. It's I just, mean, if we wanted to, we could spend the fifty GP on the stables as well, right? However, that would give us not really needed. It's not really needed. needed. Look, we'll just like once we like we'll probably want to do that maybe in the next grouping, yeah. assuming we get horses. But I feel like <laughs> next we can also um look at like we have things to generate travel throughout the city now. I think next would be like things to keep people. Yes, we should work on a bit of housing next time. But for now, besides like... that. If I think don't we're good have, now. I think we also need to figure out 
I mean, yeah, it'd be good to have housing and stuff to keep people here, but if we don't have enough production to, say, feed yeah, people... That, that is a part of moment. that that's included. So, okay. it's a delicate balance. Production three means that you can feed three housing worth of people. Uh, okay. You currently have production three uh, because one of them is automated, uh, but housing uh -huh. two. Okay, okay, I gotcha. Yeah. No, uh, yeah. All I right. think I think what we have is fine, and we just keep the seventy five in case we need it for an emergency. All right, fine by me. And, and we're just gonna get up. Uh, um, did we get like pay for like us ourselves, like personally? Uh, what do you mean? Like, did we get anything ourselves or for like helping in the mine? And oh, no, it wasn't. It wasn't like a a mine thing. Like. He was just like, this would be really useful if you did yeah. this, but it wasn't it wasn't a paying job. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to condense these if you wouldn't mind pinning the last pin after, or the last thing after I send it, get this yeah. typed out. Got it, and that'll be the meeting notes. Might want to make would a it... document at some point, but... I was going to say, would it be easier just to have a Google Doc or something? Yeah, we can or make that. Or a spreadsheet or something, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and but then we, we can, can do just... that in a bit. Yeah, All right. Yeah. So I think the last thing to handle this session uh, with session is uh, the next week will be quite like it'll be busy around town because they're going to be building several buildings. They're going to be like, hiring people, funding them, etc. Um, so you guys will have a week of downtime to yeah. do with as you wish. So uh, that can be handled both in and out of session. Just what do you want to do for a week? So I'd have to look at that. Yeah, you can help in building, you can um you can like scout out the forests, you can uh like do stuff like that. Also considering we were told about the bandits that are nearby. Yeah. yeah. Um I do wanna like what kinda there's a before that there's not really going to be any travel and even if the tavern is built, like people are not still not really gonna you know, come here that much because they don't well, really know. A tavern attracts people of a, you know, it's a good watering hole for people that are stronger than the average person. People like yourselves, adventurers, yeah, that aren't but like going to be <laughs> harassed as much on the road. So it will still attract people, just less. Yeah, but like word is not going to be instantly getting around. Like, oh, oh shit, yeah. they built the tavern yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> it'll take a bit. Uh, so there's not much. Like I'm not, yeah, I mean, not much uh, used to cruising. <laughs> but yeah, it doesn't hurt probably to help keep a little bit of watch while they're training guards and whatnot. Considering again, there's what yeah. two bandit groups nearby. <laughs> yeah. Well. Um, yeah, the bandit group is part of a bigger band. Mm-hmm. Yeah, as I said, I'm just gonna 